really is the Prince of Persia. All right, here I am. Here I use. Oh, choosing Norsk. Oh, okay. I forget, forgot that. He really is the Prince of Persia. Really is the Prince of Persia. Hey, hey, hey! Man, I only play for two hours. What am I gay? I've got to play this game for fifty hours. Yeah. Gubantuk. Gubantuk. Who you? Alright, file one, let's just jump back into the my best favorite game. Yeah. Oh, all the agonizing holiday in front of us. Oh, here oh, he is. To come back to this. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> oh, it's so <laughs> perfect. It's so beautiful. Oh, I love it so much. Alright, how do I do the... Okay, so there's that power. Um, the spirit bomb power. Uh, which which one? There it is. <laughs> sort of like, huh. I'm a cat. All right. I want to beat this game. It's so fun. Mm. Uh, where have I to go? Um, so the garden. I got to get all the lasagna in the garden, right? Got a got a mission to unlock in the castle. Lasagna in the sewer. Haven't been to the roof. Um, catacombs. All right, let's go. Let's go to the garden. Let's just fucking search for that lasagna. I know where it was. It was up in the graveyard sort of area. Yeah. But I just don't know how to get to it. I assume I have the powers now. Actually, I have the super jump. Yeah, and you can butt slam the graves. Oh, he's Garfield. Look at that fat ass. Yeah. It just gives a real sensation of smooth and fluffy and light. It's like it's like it's not even uh, It's 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 the one instance I can ever think of of like a game looking not like the movie being better than the movie looks. Do you know that? Do you yeah. know can you think of like a of a movie game where the game looks better than the movie does just aesthetically not necessarily oh. with like um, the, uh, what do you call it? Things, the... I mean... Oh, sense. You'd have to play a lot of movie tie-in games to know. I mean, like... But, like, uh, let's say a sh any Shrek game, right? Shrek looks alright, like as a movie. The games, they just look worse than Shrek, because they, they're basically the same model. But something like, um... This, where Garfield in the movie is horrible, and the movie itself is terrible. Well, yeah, the movie has to start off as terrible, you know. I got five lasagnas to find. Could, uh, catch all the lasagna, says Rum Raisin, and Scrib Warrior says Thick. Yeah, Garfield is the thick boy. Or he maybe have thick fur. So, like, there's when some... When did Thick even begin as a thing? I don't know, it just makes sense. Something's thick, as in, like, uh... It's not small... Yeah, but the T-H-I-C-C, -C, you know... Well, you know, it's just it's just the natural sort of, like, hey, what if we said a word in a funny way with, like, spelling it wrong, and then everyone was like, that's funny. Yeah. It's, like, it's like when people used to say T-H-E instead of the, like, te. Terrandoms. That was just ah. Oh, it's not a fucking lasagna. <laughs> that's that's not a fuck. There's the lasagna. Oh, it's the wall. Yeah, I don't. I don't have the um. Did you not find the wall jump power? No, I don't think I did. Do you have to go to the Prince of Persia dungeon to find it? Catch walls. Uh... Fourteen people already. Yeah, man. People love Garfield. I think they love you. Oh, 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 oh. Gay. 
just the, the idea of like, oh yeah, I'm just, I, I'm Garfield, guys. This is what I do as Garfield. I bounce on my ass, do a front flip, and a huge arc. Look at the special effects. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit of orange uh, dust. Uh, what do you call it? Cheeto dust. In American terms, we would call it what's it dust because that was that's what they're they're called. What's it? Yeah, well, I guess we have Cheetos. We just they're just who cares? No one cares yeah. about Cheetos. But what's it? Those are the guys. Yeah. Kill animals says hello, Gib. I just love his like yeah. Nothing interesting is happening at any point. It's like oh whatever. <laughs> you could see his face. Like he's like, uh, wait, yeah. I can swear you could see his face. Like he's yeah, just, yeah, yeah. Uh, whatever. His eyes don't even fucking open. <laughs> Why are you smashing ass in a graveyard? Uh, good question. Unpredictable answer. Uh, can I? No, I can't. Ah, <sighs> uh, yeah, I don't know how to get up there. Um, and I think I need the wall jump power. Maybe it's not wall jumping, but like climbing a wall like a cat would. Uh, mm. So, a mission to unlock, like, where could that be? There's like, is there like a grave you can destroy and open? No. Actually, that is a thing. Like, recently I got this power. So, if I do that, it, it goes f leaping forward. If I do a jump and then do it, it pushes buttons, like this one. You push the button. Whew. God, it's hot today. <laughs> oh, I just, I love this so much. I'm pretty sure if the Game Grumps played this, Aaron would do that for ages, because he loves walk cycles. And the idea that you could go in a complete circle while being <laughs> in the air in Garfield's walk cycle is hilarious. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot you can destroy the bush <laughs> presidency. He's already gone. I uh, wish we talk about we're we're gonna go have topics, you know. No oh, no, fuck it, I don't give a shit. <laughs> I love Garfield. We've gotta have topics in our Garfield stream, you know. Did I do this already? It looks like I do this already. Whoa. I wish I was like a map, because this garden is a big level. It is a big... I'll go explore in this place, and if I can't find anything, I'll just go back to the house and try go through the sewers, I guess, because that was the latest level. Mm. Oh, I could just get on top of the, ma the thing. Yeah, you could. Look how cute he is! <laughs> You got the little fat, fluffy paws. <laughs> it's it's way better than it should be. Okay, I've I've reiterated that enough times, but for people who haven't seen this game before, it's ridiculous how good it is. <laughs> it doesn't make any There's sense. There's lasagna. There's some lasagna. Ah, <laughs> rats. Health. Oh, lasagna's health, I forgot. Oh, you can just jump through... Oh, I need one push. lasagna? I need one lasagna. Maybe there's, like, surplus lasagna in the level. Because, like, I could see, like, multiple no lasagna. There's at least three in the in the graveyard where I was. Maybe there's one Does I can get. Does the counter change when you get to the graveyard, or is it... No, no, this is all, is all in the, the garden. Ooh. Yeah. I don't need to do the attack to do that. Okay, so that's just whatever. Yeah. With this bouncy power, I can get through the maze without fucking thinking about it. Cute little Murray. Says Stumble Real. Yeah, it is, it is like Murray from Slay 3 when he has that b uh, bouncy ball power. Oh yeah, that was my fucking favorite thing to do. God, I loved, I loved that so much. Every every mission where you could go like higher than normal with that, yeah, it's way good. Man, fucking games are so my favorite. 
Yeah. Oi, 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 oi. Whoa. Whoa. It's just like Prince of Persia. <laughs> It's funny how, like, you know, now you can just jump over the whole maze and the yeah. buttons don't even matter. And it's just like, you know what, that's cool. They had a thing that if you wanted to go there early, but now you can just fuck it, you don't even need to give a shit. You know? <gasps> a present! Could it be? Uh. Kojima! Ooh, there it is! Uh, there's one left, I did it! Oh, the paw is clapping. Picking up all that stuff is hard work. <laughs> you ate all of them, of course. <laughs> save or continue? Uh, I'll save, why not? Oh, he's hot today. The window's open. I was sweating like a chicken. Yeah, it's really, it's really annoying that the the world is lab uh, has got uh, stuff in it. <laughs> <laughs> you said it, brother. That's, That's why you're why my, you're my brother. brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not even a meme, really. It is. We've just mentioned it a couple times. We don't. I don't it's, think we've mentioned sort of what it's meme from. It's sort of a meme, or becoming one. Just be between brothers, because that because that's why you're my brother. It's it's the idea is that it's a line from Warlords, I think is the name. It's a yeah. Nicolas Cage movie, which is actually really good. But there's a section in it, or a, or a line yeah. where Nicolas Cage uh, and his brother um, yeah. are like trying to hide they're, f their they're flags, to cover up like uh, their boat. Yeah, their boat. And uh, so, uh, his brother has like a, an idea to paint over the thing, and. Nick Cage says, that's why you're my brother! And I'm like, that's a very strange reason why he's the brother. I thought that was because they had the same parents. Like, it was just a funny thing to think, the way he said it. Yeah. And every time we're brothers, <laughs> yeah. we, we say it. We were watching it. it together. Just a par <laughs> All right, what am I doing? I, I don't need to be here. Oh, that, no, there's one more. There's one more mission. I, I don't know where to go, though. So I'll go to the castle, collect all that lasagna. Uh, back to hall. Gibbon for life. Hard, hard, Gibbon hard. for love. Nice. Nice yeah. things you're saying. Thank you. Whew. Okay. Here's the training area. What if there's a secret lasagna? I don't think it has the lasagna counter while you're in this little yeah, bit. Yeah, this is the, the hub world. Yeah. Garfield's going ape shit. Woohoo! That face when no Gibbon roommate. Sad face. Woohoo! Oh, is that that face when or that feel when? I always assumed it was that feel when. Oh, that feel or that face. The same kind of thing, isn't it? Like that, that face is like about that. You know, it's about an expression which comes from a feeling. So it's pretty much interchangeable. I guess so. All right. Let's get up, fly a kite up to the lowest height. Um. Hmm. I know I've done the race. How do I get up to that lasagna there? You gotta do the race war. You gotta uh, bounce on the box to gotta... kill that Bernie Sanders. I think you have to go the whole load of way around. No, I got it. Oh, <laughs> right, maybe maybe I should go around. Oh God, oh, the, the frogs. frogs. That's okay. That's all right. Wait, I, I think. Just... Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why I suddenly get this feeling just looking at the aesthetic of like the way the graphics are is actually is actually genuinely making me think a little bit of Prince of Persia. <laughs> <laughs> why is that? Is there bloom? Is no, there like no. gratuitous bloom? No, it's just sort of like the way the lighting is on some things. It's like it, th th this room is making me think of like the red sand that fucks everybody up, everybody up just because of the color. 
Is it red? I thought it was Is more it golden. Well, yeah, it's a ready golden. I got it. Oh, I got red. one. Got one of them. You know. Man, I got a lot of lasagna to get in this level. Lasagna. It's like all over the place. So, um, yeah, I was thinking about doing the Vriska draw things again. Doing more of those. Yeah. I did a Twitter poll. I think the poll... I don't know whether it ended by the time I checked, but it was pretty much uh, everybody wanted episodes instead of streams. So I'll continue to do gaming streams instead of drawing streams. Uh, but uh, I don't know. I, I, I kind of like the idea of, of streaming. You know, some people voted for it. So I may occasionally do that as well. Yeah. So that'll be good. I had I have like um, a schedule of of the week planned out. Like I'm I'm doing something basically every week, basically every day of the week. Um, like on Mondays it's these. It's the it's the um, the stream on Twitch. And on Fridays is the same thing. A video game. Uh, Tuesdays is now uh, apparently arm retrieval. So I'm going to be recording that tomorrow hmm. until that's done and then uh, Wednesdays and or Thurs <coughs> th th Thursdays excuse me <coughs> excuse me it's a the fucking fucking uh, the fucking uh, fucking Garfield the game <laughs> uh, no, no uh, it's it's the poddy cast on Wednesdays and or Thursdays depending on when Nate's available <laughs> fucking dog okay I haven't been in this room that's why there's so many lasagna to get <laughs> he won't go. The he won't fuck. go away. Oh. What are you gonna do about it? Oh my god! I didn't know he was an asshole. <laughs> I thought you, he was just gotta, trying to kill me. Wait, wait! You gotta, you gotta slam him with your big butt. No, it's okay. I got a lasagna. Lasagna. Uh. 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 Just imagine having these big. Oh, I've already said it, but it's still funny to me. The big axes. Missions not available. Play all the missions first. Which ones? You gotta I, get the lasagna. I gotta unlock it. Maybe the lasagna will do it. Yeah. It's the it's the only missions I have available to me really. So I just guess I better get those lasagnas. Yeah, to fuck you, pot. Oh, I can fuck with that. I didn't oh. know I could fuck with those. Oh, that's great. Gotta leave a, a trail of cat destruction. Cat attack. Cat attack. The fat cat sat on your, his ass and killed you. <laughs> Boy. Uh, I've been thinking about what I'm doing other than the work. Oh yeah, what is your work? Are you are you a, 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 a what are you a gardening man now? You're sort doing of. doing the gardens. I really want it to like move a little faster, but the last time it moved too fast, stuff went wrong. But it's supposed to be like uh, may have mentioned before, but it's like um, almost voluntary, but you still get paid. It's a, a program to help people get into sort of work and stuff. Oh, I can kill him. Yeah. And uh, basically, it's like I got a part-time one day uh, a week thing. And uh, as I get like more into the swing of things, I'm supposed to like move oh. up more days or stuff. Uh, and yeah. It's not like an actual wage job, you don't get paid that much. You get paid enough to, uh, what, you need to have a license for public liability insurance. Oh no, no, let oh. me out! Ah, <coughs> something in my tooth. Public liability insurance so that when you're working, you're like covered, so like, they just basically don't want to get sued for like having me work and then I I don't know I chop my arm off with an axe. Lol. Which I wouldn't do, but you know. But maybe someday. <laughs> but maybe I'll one day reach the final zenith and fucking chop my arm off. 
yeah. <gasps> Fucking okay. A secret. Wow. <laughs> this is so. But yeah, that's cool. that's what happens on Tuesdays, basically. And I wanna. You I want, wanna, so you're saying it's uh, it's moving not fast enough? What do you, yeah, you want to happen? Like, the the thing is, it's like. Like, like, let's say th this last week of, you know, being at a French uh, castle and shit, which was cool, and I love it, but, like, every week, like, so much shit happens in between Tuesday that I, I, I'm, like, the, trying to get a regular schedule when I just, I'm not that kind of person, um, you know, if it was, like, all weekend you're forced to be there all the time, and it's like, okay, I'm gonna get used to this because it's like, it doesn't go away long enough for me to get lazy again. Oh right, you mean you'd rather have a more more st uh, uh, more uh, more Stability. hours, so that you can get used to the idea of getting up every day instead yeah. of getting up once a week, which is very strange. Yeah. Yeah, I feel that. I feel that. Um, uh, that unnerving goo. But I mean, like. I don't know, I think about like the time when I worked for Dad at Stanford and the reason it was too much is because I would get up at like 6 or maybe even 5 in the morning, uh, get driven to some place and a bunch of other baggage, but it's mainly just like I, I, the amount of stress you get without any relief because, I mean like, mainly it's because of like who I am and it's like uh, a lot of the workers, they, they know how to sort of like find enough energy to sort of like still be awake for an afternoon to like enjoy TV or something. Um, but like by the time I get home, I'm so exhausted that I just fall asleep and then it's like uh, 5 a.m. Uh, uh, you know, I was like, what? I. I only just got home, how is it like work again? So my existence was like purely work and no fun. And now it's like, it's sort of the opposite almost, where like I have a little bit too much free time and I need that, I need it to be like a nice have you, middle have you, road. Is it like a thing you can do to us for more hours or? I could, but like, uh, I don't, don't know. Wanna, don't wanna. <laughs> it's, it's like, the thing is, is that is the, they want me to work with this other guy, and he only does it once a week, and they don't really want me to do it alone yet, um, because, I don't know, uh, I need to know the people in the houses for the gardens at first before, you know, I'm allowed to do it alone. So until I can do it alone, I have to work with this other guy who only does it, like, once a week as hmm. well, but he, he's just done that for a long time, and he, you know, whereas I'm just sort of all over the place. Uh, I don't know. I would say just ask for more work and see what they, because they, if they know you want more work, they'll figure out how to give it to yeah. you. I remember what worked quite well was, like, um, having, like, one day of, like, work, and it, it was like, at college, it was like, uh, three days throughout the week. Um, you know, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And then there was the Tuesday and Thursday off to do whatever. But, you know, you never have enough days, you know, like, one day there, one day away, one day there, one day away. So you still, you know, it's enough of a pattern that you, you know, you can memorize it easier, but... Oh, uh, you know... Fuck. It'll, it'll happen eventually, it's just... Uh, I don't know. God, what do I do? It Go said... It's, he, he said uh, like a long jump will, will get the switch, but from where? Hmm. Oh. There it is. <laughs> oh, well, there we go. Oh. Gorgut's Gun Smasher. Oh, look, it's the Lasagna Cup game. Yeah. Literally, ca people. Uh, literally right now getting lasagna. Man, I only need eight more lasagnas. We got 20 whole people watching the Lasagna Cat. Lasagna Cat. Have you seen Lasagna Cat? The videos. 
I've seen the one where the... You've seen the one? That one with the guy, you know, talking about the panel. Yeah, you yeah. should watch all of them. It's basically, you know, re like really old internet, but it's, it's recently just ki came back for no reason. Well, not for no reason, because it's great. That's why it came back. Uh, I don't want to play it again now. Oh, no, wait, I do. I do. Oh, I do. It's the mouse one. I want to play it again. But, like, it was just, uh, just, it was, the idea was take a comic strip of Garfield, act it out in live action with green screen with a big guy with a, with a thing. <laughs> like, the one you watched is not like all of them. It's usually with a guy, an actor, playing Garfield in a big Garfield costume. Oh. And he acts, they act out the panel, and then it's a laugh track, and then afterwards it's a ridiculous weird thing. Cool. Oh! Ooh, it's a little mouse. Look at his chubby cheeks. Tail physics, mouse physics. <laughs> it's the best <laughs> game I've ever mouse seen. Mouse physics. It's real mouse physics, though. You can feel the. Mouse. I can feel the mouse through the controller. <laughs> <laughs> you can feel him in your hand, squirming about. Like, look at him. Look at how cute he is. Ooh. Ooh, he's pushing the little ball. Alright. Uh, I forget how to do this one. You grab him with a button, I think. Um. Or something. Maybe you just walk up to them. I'm trying to try buttons. Uh, just, it's not that. Uh. Uh, 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 I didn't need to do this. I didn't need to do this. I just love this so much. He's got a little ball. He's pushing it. He's pushing it good. Mm. Can, yeah. I, can I? Can I abandon? Yeah, yeah. Abandon that mission. I don't need. I don't need to do it again. But it's just nice to see little mousy. Yeah. All right, now there's a lasagna up in here. <coughs> there's a lasagna up in here, baby. <coughs> oh, it's not a lasagna. It is a extra life. Oh, that's that's the the slicey death. That's the Prince of Persia. All right, it's right there. Uh, wait, I can probably get it to it from here. Oh, not quite. Maybe from on top of the box. Oh, the timing. It's not bad, it's just I... I'm very used to doing it early. Alright. So let's try and stay up here. Get the lasagna over there. Yeah. How do I get that you one? You get the go to the box. I think you came up here, but then you missed the jump and then didn't... Oh yeah, how do back. I do this one? Yeah, like, that is the question. Can you, like, look down? Uh, fucking what the fuck? Maybe I don't. Th I don't think I should do it like that. I think I go this way. Yeah, I think you gotta go around to get to the other bit, then go around, then go to get to the other bit, then go around to get to the other bit, then go around to get to the other bit, then go around to get to the other bit. Then go around to get to the other bit. Then go around to get to the other bit. No, 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 no. I'll just try it. Uh, cause that's the way back up from from down. Dark Souls and show you a path before you can go to it, and then it's gonna Whoa, okay. be possible. I, I just had to do I'm that. I'm an idiot. <gasps> and Dark Souls, why does everybody compare every game to Dark Souls when they should be comparing it to, to the, Garfield to the, to the movie, the game? Yeah, Garfield, the best Prince of Persia DLC you ever seen. Oh, okay. Huh. No. Fuck! Stupid fucking ceiling bitch. Now how do I get back in through here? Man, if only you could be a duck all the time. It would be really useful if that flying boy was actually... 
I guess those don't really do anything. I know, I, you just missed that. It, I know, but like, it, I feel like it's got a generous hitbox because of the stuff you have to do about it. It's funny though, if it's, it's, it's not even a challenge, so why is it there? It's just there to add to the atmosphere. Bitchin', got it, yeah. baby. Don't fall now. I'm not going to foil. <gasps> no! They would have pushed me off. Another garbage. Only four left. Dude, I might get oh, the, the lasagna high score. The lasagna high score. <gasps> it's not going up here. No foil going to be on. <gasps> there it is. There oh. it is. Alright, how do I... Alright, let's just do a double jump. Ooh, yeah. Ooh baby! Ooh, yeah. I found a secret. Or maybe it's not a secret, but it's cool either way. An alternate route. Yeah, I feel like you've been here before. I probably have. Oh. I don't remember that. Maybe I just never looked up. I don't think you looked up. That's the roof, though. What does the roof look like? If it's just like got weird open bits. That's not the roof. That's like. Uh, Where's the light coming through from? from no, no, no. It's not. Well, it's the roof of this place, but it's like a floor of somewhere else. Probably like a fl an outside f a bit. Bit of wood. A bit of wood. A bit of wood. I bet it would. Oh, you bet ye it would. would I bet ya. your ass. Wouldn't you? Abandoned mission feels too mean. Um. Oh, because, like, I abandoned the mousy. And now he's just there with his ball. And he's like, Garfield? Garfield! I did it! And I'm way away. I'm just like, eh, yeah, fuck it. Abandoned mouse. Abandoned mouse. Abandon him to. Uh, oh no, now, it's, now it is sad. Now, now, he's, now he, he becomes Rambo Mouse. Why? Because he was abandoned by the system. The military didn't give a fuck about him. I don't know the where Garfield that's happened in Garden. The military didn't give a fuck about the mouse. And Rambo. And the mouse is Rambo. I don't know where the, how that happened. <laughs> in Mouse Bow. I don't know either. Have you seen Ram? I, I've i seen uh, one of them where, in like, at the end, where he's like in the offices and he's, he's like a c civilian guy he came back from the war and everybody's treating him like shit and then he goes on a rampage i haven't seen any rambos all i know is that he's a muscles he gun there muscles was a really and guns emotional scene at the end where he's like uh you know talking about uh wait what people calling him a baby killer yes, well, i'm not a big baby boy <laughs> Get out. I'm not a big baby killer. <laughs> I'm not a big baby. Oh, I can unlock it from just walking through the. Okay. <laughs> Garfield, the last cat. He's the last cat in the world. He doesn't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> well, who would? I guess As the last cat. Garfield, the last cat. He's really sad about this fact. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's uh, 76. Sam, Sam, Sam. You have Sammy Sam? Four. Four more. Four more. Or? More. Or for your boring ass. Shit. I pressed the button. Oh, wait, this is the place of the dog. Isn't it? There's a dog here. I think. I think he killed him. He's dead. Oh god. Oh god. Oh good. Dead dog, the last dog. Oh, He's can the... you get on top of the chandelier? Yeah, I'm just looking to see if there's any lasagna. Oh my god, there's one up there. There must be more. Might be more. Um, How to do this? Well, I, I saw it right back there. You go on the table and then you jump on the chandelier. Oh, like... Oh, it's quite low. Okay. Gotcha.
We went up. Yeah. Well, okay. One, two. All right, let's get one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo. Accidentally didn't do the thing. Feel like there might be one more around, but I don't know. Well, this is like a mission to get the vases, the vases, the vooses. The Vamooses. And, um, I don't, th I don't know why I can't do the mission yet, because I've done a Vaz Destruction mission in another place. Mm. Uh, two more fucking Lasagnes. Yeah. Maybe I, I, might, I must have killed the dog. I assumed I like maybe lured him out of the normal spot, but I no, guess I just I, broke I, his fucking neck by sitting on him. <laughs> yeah. At incredibly high speed. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's play some game. There's no oh. holes. Yeah, it's cause it's um, it's a it's a fuckaroo table. You know those kinds that they, they, they don't have holes. Um, fuck, what is it called? There's types. There's a type of table that doesn't have holes, and it has three balls. Like, you're supposed to hit one ball to hit both of them, and that's the challenge, but there's no holes. It's a whole game that has a whole separate table. It's very strange. Yeah. Uh, it's not billiards unless it is. Why wouldn't you just, like, have a table with the holes and then have hole covers? Maybe it is billiards. You know, like a little thing that you put over the holes. No, billiards, I think, is the one with the all the numbered ones and the eight ball. Yeah, I think that's what that is. Pool, pool is... No, that's pool. Snooker is the one with the colored balls. Pool is the one with the, the numbered balls. And, and billiards red. is the no, one with that. Pool was the one with the yellow and red and then the black. Oh, no, yeah, you're right. Pool is that one. God, there's so many ball games. Balls. Balls. Ooh, can you open the door? Can I open the door? Can you open the door? Don't you think open so. Open the door from somewhere. I like I like this this like like partial reflection. Like some of the floorboards are shiny and some aren't. I think it's sort of based on just where you are. Well, like look at that. They have texture. See. Oh uh, yeah. So like so they, they they made it so that it's like a really quite realistic the way that a shiny floor would be. Some floorboards are just not as shiny as others. They got a bit of roughness to them. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a legitimately good game. <laughs> yeah, that's why it's a good game. It is. It is. A, <laughs> it is a legitimately good game. Uh, I mean yes, but that's not why. It's just an added bonus. Oh, look at the sun. Praise the sun. Oh, God. praise the sun, Garfield! <laughs> praise the sun! Oh, praise the sun! Sands! Sands, I love dark souls! I love uh, praising Garfield. the sun! Oh, Undertaler would definitely be a celeb bro. A sun bro. Yeah. Praise the sun, Sands! Isn't it lovely? <laughs> You you came out of the underworld and now you use the sun sands. Praise the sun. Oh, I love Solaire. He's my favorite. Yeah, God right. damn it, Undertaler. Oh, praise the sun. <gasps> Fire! Yes! Praise the sun! Oh. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, you, you should have just blasted out of there. <laughs> <laughs> What did you hit? I hit my ass on the thing, and then I hit my head on a frying pan and fell to the ground. <laughs> now, if this was in the movie, that would have been animal torture. <laughs> be really animal fucking torture. funny. Really fucking funny. Really fucking funny. I can't see anything in this dark place. 
I can't tell if there's a lasagna, but I assume there's nothing. They simply invert the world upside down and put an overlay for the floor. Hmm. Is that how they do that? I guess. No. Oh, you mean for the reflection? Yeah, probably. That's pretty cool to know. It's, I mean, reflections are like normal, but like the, the idea that they had a reflective surface, but it wasn't completely the same amount of reflective like it would be as if it was an actual like partially um, polished floor. That's yeah. what was impressive about it, that they put the textures in there. Like, you think of a shitty Garfield movie game, and you don't think uh, attention to detail. But that, yet there it is. Yeah. Yeah, I've been all the way through here. Oh boy. Isn't it nice when just, like, licensed things are just good? Yeah, it is nice. Doesn't happen often. Bugs Life game, pretty great. Yeah. Um, I mean, Disney products in general, uh, to when it comes to video games, especially the early 90s, oh yeah, they, they knew how to make a game or two. Tarzan was good. Yeah. I remember it was on Hercules. PC. And uh, you collect the banana. And the weird fruit that you throw. Oh yeah. I'm just I'm speed running now. Oh fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, hands. Just gotta find those last two lasagnas. Hang on, did I see a lasagna? Lasagna. No, that's a box that was broken. Oh, I didn't do it. Well, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Oh man, I can't find them. Where are they? Could be even. Funny, this is like a fucking map. Yeah. Catch all the lasagna. I should probably go to the sewer. There's two things here. Two things. Well, they say you got to unlock them by getting the lasagna. I don't know whether that's the truth. I think if I go near to them. I think. Well, that other one that was unlocked that Wait. you didn't do. Can I even go to the roof? Maybe I have the roof unlocked. Actually, I have no idea. I mean, was the sewer even locked to begin with? It was. Oh, right. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go try it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try... Go in... Go into the sewer. Or the, no, I'll go try and go to the roof, and if it says, you must do this and that, then I'll do this and that, if I can. But if I can't find the lasagna, then what are the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> Funny tale. I just like how fucking bouncy, it is so yeah, happy. so bouncy, bouncy. This door leads to the rooftops. Get me in there! Alright, it's locked, obviously. So let's go to the sewers. the sewers. I might get lucky and find all the lasagna, lasagna in here anyway. Maybe you'll find how to wall jump, just like in Prince of Persia. I want that power, yes. I mean, like, this this would be where you get it. <laughs> <laughs> what logic does that have in your brain? Because this is the Prince of Persia level, where we discovered that this is Prince of Persia. Oh, you know, you're right. You're absolutely wrong. Oh, fuck. Uh, whew! Man, look at that green. Ooh, there's one. Yes, I remember. You gotta smash barrels to get lasagnas. And I like, I, I really like, I just noticed, the barrels are already smashed. They're not unsmashed. Oh, yeah. I don't have to re-smash them. Cool. Uh, yet another really handy game thing that's like uh, you wouldn't expect from Garfield. Yeah. Alright, so there's stuff over there. How I'm do I get a over Toy there? Story vibe just because you're able to stand on this? 
How do I get over there? You know the Toy Story 2 CD? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that, oh. was, that was a cool game. With lots of good soundtracks and, and stuff. It only has one soundtrack. Oh yeah, I mean, uh, music's on a Actually, now, you, now that you say it like that, I'm, I'm not so sure. Like, soundtrack? Like, a track? Like, why does it mean the whole set of tracks if it's a, a soundtrack? Oh wait, that's a map on the floor. Is it? I think it is. Go down. It says, you are here. Oh. Well, that's good. I didn't see the... I didn't see it. <laughs> you know... Super I, cool says, Hey gamers! Hey gamers! Oh, catfish. <laughs> you can skip my poker if you know what I mean. I don't. I don't either. But I endorse it. Man, I haven't been here. There's so much shit to break. Like yeah. my own head. God, the kill, scary kill, frogs. kill, 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 kill. The frog's asshole. Frog. <gasps> if you know how to wall jump, use it on two walls. Uh, well, I don't know. I don't know how. I hope you yeah, would I tell me. I think the assumption is you'll learn it here because that's where the t tutorial shit is. Yeah. I might find all the lasagna in this level. It seems simple enough. You just break shit. Hearing a dog and a monkey argue in the background. Let's, let's just do that. Jump on a wall and press X. And yeah, it doesn't work. I don't have the power. Also, what's down there? Oh, is it just shit? Alright. It's <laughs> just shit. It's like in extremely big grapes that he would fall through. Yeah. Really standing. That's what I like. I like that about video games. I like that about video games. If you have a real life great and you could fall through it, but you don't because you're a video game. Yeah. Video games. It lets you do that. <laughs> hey gamers. It lets you do that. Gamers. Gamers lets you do that. Games lets you die. In real life, you can commit suicide. Right. No. It's hard to because you can't you can't move the the uh looking thing in a little bit and then stop. It's either you're moving a certain amount at a time. So I can see there's a few barrels down there. I'm just gonna fucking go get them. Go get them. The uh, champion. Cat. <gasps> tiger. Woods. Uh, uh, Tony the Tiger. Remember Frosties? Oh, I wanna eat Frosties! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now I do. Now that I've said it. I'm like, well, you know, I do. Yeah. I am delicious. That I mean, I am going bicycles. to eat that. I like the bright. Well, you know, that's sugar. Sugary is is goodery. Yeah. Although I remember uh, when I went to America for Radcon One, I deliberately tried some uh, sweet as fuck American cereals, just cause I've heard. I've heard the stories and the rumors that they have the strongest sweeteners in all the world, and I just want to know, what the fuck is it actually sounding like, tasting like? What was it like? Uh, it was very sweet. Uh, too much, too big. Too big sweets. I couldn't eat it. I mean, I could, I ate all of it, but I didn't like it. 
I remember one time a friend I mean, I did of, like a it, friend but, you know, of mine from a long are. time ago, uh, he sent over a box uh, to me of like American sweets. Uh, this was like in the Brody gay days. You don't need to mention that. I don't know. I, s I just find it like, who would even send me a box? Well, uh, I don't know. He was weird. <laughs> a brony. <laughs> the only person who would send sweets. What a weirdo. <laughs> no. It was just like an overly emotional relationship for retarded reasons. Therefore, he would actually send me a box with like a note of like Merry Christmas from his mom and also him. Uh, <laughs> here's, here's, here's some American sweets because you remember when you were like on Skype for like nine hours and you talked about like different sweets? He, here you go. <laughs> that That's what fucking happened. Um, and yeah, I got like. I what like was that. it? Jolly Rancher, Apple Little Cylinders. Uh, fucking, I'm addicted and I need more. <laughs> it was so sweet. But I'm the kind of guy who loves overly sweet, d you know, destructive, powerly sweet things. <laughs> destructive power. <laughs> you know. Oh. I, I, I like the kind of sweetness that usually makes people go too much. I would be like, I am finally a real. Uh, basically, I, I just, I really like, yeah. I, I tried Tootsie Rolls for the first time. Weird substance. No idea what it is. Isn't it like licorice? No, it's kind of like weird. It's, ooh, I don't know how to describe it. It's like a, it's not toffee. It's like, it, it's, it's just a substance. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great way to describe something. Yeah, but it's, it's so weird because I can't think of what to compare it to because I don't know what it's made out of. It's, it's almost like edible plasticine, even though I, I like I, I, I like it. I like how it tastes. Uh, I like the feeling of it, but it's like I, I don't understand. <laughs> I just don't. God. Girls jammed, only an animal smaller than you can get through to open it. Right. Oh. That means I need the mouse. But, uh, how do I get the mouse? Maltesers. I'll send you Jolly Ranches if you bring me Maltesers. Uh, <laughs> yes. Well, yeah. actually, I don't care. I you do. care about I, Jolly Ranches. I, do. I just want to eat Maltesers. I'm going to fucking buy Maltesers. <laughs> Is that the company? And then just. And destroy it in front of you. I will just, like. A lengthen the conveyor belt straight into <laughs> the house, and then have another conveyor belt all the way back to me with Jolly Ranchers, <laughs> and that'll be the business strategy. <laughs> Just a really long conveyor belt to <laughs> <laughs> trade Jolly Ranchers for more. Uh, like all the way across the the per the Atlantic Ocean. Yeah. Just a long <laughs> tube. Yeah. <laughs> And then it gets clogged because it's one tube for two different things going to the other <laughs> direction. And then there's just a big bunch of shit in the middle of the ocean. And, you're yeah, like, well, and then they, they fuse and become... Uh, jolly teasers. They become Tootsie Rolls. Oh. Well, now I know. Right, so I'm going in there. I'm going in there now. This is Prince of Persia. <gasps> ah! It's Prince of Persia! It's Prince of Persia! <laughs> oh, there it is. The boxes, the last boxes oh, that probably I see. have the lasagna. They probably have the lasagna. Probably have the lasagna. Eh, 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 eh. Um, One <laughs> more to go. One more to go. Yes. There it is. <laughs> Why are they having this long conversation right next to these fucking <laughs> things? <laughs> You can now do the long jump! Ooh. You can now do the challenge mission in the castle. Fucking. Yes. Right. Long jump. What the fuck? Clapping bulldog. I already oh. thought I had a long jump, but I guess that's just a leap. 
Yeah, it is a clapping bulldog. I fucking love the clapping bulldog. He Every time he comes in. He is the best. He's just like, hey, well, well done. Clap, clap. But human claps. And also, why you're, you're a little dog. He's also really condescending. Oh, how how long could this long jump be? <laughs> like how many fucking powers do I have? You're gonna do like a slide light. by You're moving. gonna do like a light. <laughs> oh! What? What? <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> That's fucking amazing. That's just like going in like a direction for a while. <laughs> you that, you you basically fly. You're flying. You're a flying cat. Oh my god. <laughs> You're getting flying. better at all this. You, any of these things would be unbelievable, but I'm getting so powerful. It's just like pressure, pressure, bro. I want to do the longest jump I can. I want to get him bouncing, bro. He's like, oh yeah, yeah, just, just jumping like, just flying. I'm a <laughs> flying cat. Garfield's power is only limited by his imagination. Well, whoa, wait a minute. I'm now more powerful. The mash mission on the rooftops. Holy shit. I need to go to the rooftops. Um, before I do that... Actually, no, I'll just go to the rooftops. But I'm I'm more powerful than Bubsy. Like, I'm... Bubsy go on you? Because, cause like, cause Bubsy's thing is that he can fly. And he does... It, what, how? And I, I can already jump real high, like him. Let's try it. Let's try the, the long jump. That's just too long. I'm. I literally. It's just gliding. Just, just go. Just uh, choose uh, uh, coordinates. Uh, 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 lock the x-axis. Just go in yeah. any wider Witches direction. Witches have a hard time keeping up with this witch cat. Which cat is he's that? A little bitch, and he flies. <laughs> <laughs> I can turn in midair. Good fucking lord. <laughs> I, I like the fact that the like people the who made this game just, just wanted to have fun. Yeah, they obviously did. Like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like, you have to do this first. Oh, I can just, I can just, uh, like, like, you can go like, huh, and then just go from ooh, like ooh. that. Can you, like, jump then... Fly, uh, you know, uh, kick off the, you know, dive. No, that's that's that. If you, the, the same button does that, but like if it. All right, so I got. I I want to see the very last frame of which I can can begin a long jump. There's no <laughs> cooldown. Is what kind of gets me. Says radical FPR. All right, that's that. Do 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 do. I am a text to speech. And of course, it's called Winston. What? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. Uh, Garfield knows what he's doing. <laughs> Gar Garfield knows what he's doing. Oh my oh, god! Wow. Uh, bigger than I imagined. I this thought it was. Fucking. This is better than Mario. This is better than Mario Galaxy. Oh my god! But it. What if it's over? No, no, no. There's the catacombs yet. Yeah, but then what? Um, I'll play it again. <laughs> All right. God, I don't want it to be oh, look, over. Oh, look, look, leaves. What does this mean? Does this mean what I think? I don't want the Garfield DLC to be over. <laughs> That's no true. He cat. is no ordinary cat. <laughs> it's very fucking true. I don't care about the story, just, uh, yeah. <laughs> I wanna, I mean, You're that's the wrong way to do it. I wanna get to a high point and do oh, that. Man. Praise the fucking sun. It's fucking beautiful. Oh, yeah. I don't know how to wall jump. I, I, I yet more powers I'm gonna get. Oh, I'm excited. <laughs> it really is. It really is print. Well, I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what was he doing? He was just he's like he turns his butt to me, 
There you go, this is my spikes. Look at me. Um, oh, well, uh, hello. Hello, uh, I, I'm gonna make you stomp, 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 stomp. I'm angry, I'm angry, and then, and then I'm fine. I'm just, just gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so this is literally being It's literally Mario. Hillary Clinton. Don't hold up too much hope, but if you manage to follow me, I'll have to admit you are better than me. Uh. Should be easy enough, bitch! I'm Garfield! Yeah, this is li li literally better than Mario Odyssey, even though it doesn't exist yet. It does, it just does like... It? Is it fucking? Huh? No! 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 I did it wrong. I did it wrong. I was trying to do the long jump. All right, restart. After you beat Garfield, continue Prince of Persia. Yes. Yeah. Good idea. <laughs> we'll look up walkthroughs if we have to. Like, no. No. The thing about Prince of Persia that I was getting annoyed with was, uh, it it fucking sucks. <laughs> Fuck. I went away quicker before. Because the combat was too difficult, and I couldn't really do anything, that's why. Like, if I was stuck, then it would be different. Yeah. But a combat thing being annoying, and too difficult. Yeah. Yeah. You, you, what are you gonna do about the fucking frog? Where is he? Oh. Jesus. <laughs> what is happening? Oh man. Imagine. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> no! You can do it! I can do it! I can't actually. Oh. I can't actually get up there. Oh. Fuck! That's really. Like, it doesn't make any sense where I'm supposed to be going to catch him. Because he's just fucking flying wherever he fucking wants. Yeah. Shit. Like. Alright. Right, I'll just calmly fucking fly. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, we juggalos. No! Fuck! This is really. Alright. The long jump, I don't. I just don't really understand how to get it right. Mm. I really shouldn't have started with the race, I should have started exploring. Yeah. Maybe, uh... <laughs> <laughs> what? It's the frog. You fucking fuck. Maybe uh, you go up onto the... not that one, but the other thing. If... No, I know, I know. But like, this is the way to get from Ooh, here. Hold up. Yeah. I had to do that. Now what? Now what do you want, huh? Where do I fucking go? God. Frogs. Oh, what? 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 <laughs> You're alive! Yeah, but what am I supposed to do? Alright, alright, alright. Nope. I'm just gonna fall there. Oh, God. No frogs left alive. No frogs left alive. No frogs left alive. Kill the frogs. Who's even gonna be Frog Fractions when there's Garfield? It's a draw! Okay, they're just doing a bit. It's not actually a draw. I won. <laughs> Phew! That was good. Uh, it was about... They were talking about a, a Garfield tornado coming towards you and there's nothing you can do about it. What would you think? Dude, top 10 skyboxes. Whoa. It's gonna have to be like top 100 at some point. 
Oh no, the frog is eyeing you. Where is he? He's like a Mexican standoff, except he's jumping and not looking at you. <laughs> he's looking at you from the... <laughs> he just dematerializes. It's amazing. Alright, uh, goodbye! <laughs> Oh, it's not as it doesn't go as horizontal as I thought. All right. <laughs> oh, this is a cool level to explore the new mechanic, though. We're flying and shit. <laughs> <laughs> you can't stop the Garfield. You can't stop him. He's like he's more powerful than any shonen anime. Yeah. There he goes. There he goes. This should be easy, right? Cause like I'm I'm in the air, like I'm not inside a fucking corridor. Yeah, but maybe it'll be like Superman sixty four. Forty six. Go where you go to hell. Uh, uh, he shit. <laughs> this duck skate. <laughs> Really fucking really gay. Fucking gay. <laughs> yeah, ee, woo. Can't barf the Garf. We need to weaponize Garfield and destroy North Korea once and for all. <laughs> nice. Wait, can you get the lasagna as the duck? I assume no, because then you could just do this mission over and over. Well, why don't you see? Because I can't not give a fuck about doing it properly. I'm a bird. I have bird rules and regulations. I go quack. Every so often. And then you're fucking really fast. You know, because I had a, dr a, cup, a, cup, oh, a cup of tea. A cup of tea. Oh gee. Uh, yeah. Oh gee, fuck you, I cunt. Thirty-eight. One minute. Eh. As long as I get another one of these. Yeah, that'll be good. Yeah. I think I can do this. There's a cup just right fucking there. Oh, the lens flare. For some reason, I like it. <laughs> yeah. It's maybe it's because maybe it's because the level is like it's shiny, like like it like it's built to be in sunset, and that's why you would have a lens yeah. flare because it's low in the sky. Yeah, it's not too harsh either. Everything's smooth, nice and fuck, soft. Fuck. Fuck. Feeling. Fuck. Five. I need to get that T. Need to get that T. Got it. Ooh, there he goes. I guess I didn't need to get it. Sure. Oh yeah. Oh, it's Garfield time. Uh. Imagine if you could Why is there a big spider? Sorry, it's just a huge spider on the roof. Why would you do that? <laughs> well, you know, they're an established enemy. No, I mean... <laughs> Why wouldn't there be frogs on the roof? Or anything? <laughs> Maybe there should be crows. With long tongues? No, they just dive at you and they're like, um, oh, gay. <laughs> Got the long jump, dude. <laughs> I'm better than Bubsy by every margin. Every single way that he is better than other things. Like, every th every uh, advantage he has, Garfield is better. He's a, gr he's a cute ginger cat. Garfield's way gingerier and cutier. 
he can do the long jump and the glide now. He can do the really high jumpy jump jump. Uh, he's in a really good platforming game in 3D. Bubsy doesn't have that. God damn, Garfield, you're good. You're good. <laughs> yeah. If there's any reason to hate Bubsy, it's because he's shit <laughs> compared to Garfield. Yeah. Um, a happy boy. I exist. That's true. Wow. <laughs> what do you do? Uh, what do I do? What do you do? What do I do? <laughs> what do you do? What am I like? Ha <laughs> ha. <sighs> uh, you have been thinking about streaming again. Oh yeah, you stream. I, 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 I forget whether you did it bunches of times. Because uh, you never tweet about it. Yeah, the thing, like, I did it, I tweeted about it once and nobody came. So I've just sort of been, like... I thought I'd follow you on Twitter, I've uh, seen it. Yeah, I don't know. Like, Maybe it's just one of those times where Twitter just decides to not show it to people. Because mm. that happens. Yeah, maybe I'll try again with the Twitter. Um, but last time, yesterday, I did a little bit of just like whatever streams. Just like purposefully, I don't care, it's bad stream. Uh, to just sort of get over my hang-ups about caring too much. Uh, and like, hey, you know, two guys came. And that was like, I didn't advertise it at all. And two people came for a little bit and then left. And I was like, yeah, you know what? I, that that I consider a small success that uh, you know I looked at it. <laughs> it's better than like the last time when nobody nobody went. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> but like I've just been thinking like I mean sometimes I have things to say but usually I'm just sort of quiet. So cute. I'm like wondering if maybe I need another person to like so I don't know I started thinking of this ridiculous situation in which um uh oh I'm a co-host on a stream oh, I I better fucking I'm now going to branch out and do my own stream but then that co-host he does exactly the same thing and then people, <laughs> uh, one after the other, like after your stream ends, my stream begins, and then my co-host stream begins, and then they watch that, and they just never stop watching streams because every co-host, every streamer <laughs> uh, of a co-host uh, has another stream going on <laughs> all the time. And everybody just dies. No. Uh -huh. I don't know why everybody dies. Oh, they can't stop watching the stream. Oh. <laughs> they Not can't even... go to eat. <laughs> well, that's funny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, it, it is difficult to do any sort of Let's Play completely alone. Yeah. Uh, when I did the World of Warcraft Let's Plays, I had to cut so much of it out. Um... To, to the point where it became too too much work, really. Mm. But yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't know whether I could be, like, uh, co-hosting your streams. Mostly because uh, yeah. I, I only have, like, so much time in the week yeah, to do streams at all. Yeah, the thing. is like, I'm doing this because I've got the time, and I'm like, I don't know. Ugh. One of them things. I mean, like, I, I, I think I just need to do it anyway, just to get better at it. I feel like uh, I've, I've slightly improved at like just talking. I mean, I, I, when I think back, when I actually think way, way back, I'm a whole lot better at like just talking, even at like volume. Cause I used to, I, you know, I feel like, uh, haha, gay parties. I feel like Fluttershy when she said, oh, I used to be really shy, but I'm not anymore. Uh, I feel like I'd be saying the same thing about mumbling, except I still kind of do, but at the same time, I, I'm a lot louder than I was, you know? 
I, I, I am able to speak up whenever, well, I used to literally just be only able to mumble, that, that was just a thing. Yeah. But now look at you. Yeah. Gay. I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel the same way about my Let's Plays. If you ever, if anybody ever looks at, back at the Rayman 2 one, the very first Let's Play I ever did, uh, very shit. But like, I don't know, I haven't watched it properly myself, so I don't know whether it's actually still uh, good to watch. Um, and I don't expect anyone to go and try to watch it to find out, unless they're doing it for the first time. Yeah. So maybe there's some funny moments, but I'm definitely not as confident in speaking, and yeah. it shows. I thought there was, I, the thing, the problem uh, though, with like this, this, the stream VODs that I had, I had them up there, but there was like copyright music, so I was listening to music, and I, because I didn't have anyone to talk to, it just sort of uh, makes me think and be more active. I don't know how to like have music, but it not be picked up by OBS or anything. Uh, you know. Well, yeah, I mean the whole idea of OBS recording your computer is that it's it can't record. It records what your speakers would be putting out. Yeah. So you can't uh, split it up unless you listen to music on a phone or something. That is a point. But then the microphone would pick it up. Oh, headphones. Uh, like one earbud with a in a phone and like then a head for all like uh, uh, yeah. It's a really weird setup to like have headphones to stop the computer noise coming through the microphone and then like uh, underneath those headphones are earbuds with music in them. Oh, the little mouse boy. He's so cute. Oh, he's tried so hard to push it, but he can't because it's fucking in the corner. Yeah. I just really love, I really love the small parts of the game design that actually make it fun. Like, you can pull and push. Yeah. There's, no, there's no bullshit there. And, you know, controlling him and doing... It's, it's weird. It's weird because it's just... You would never think. Yeah. Oh. Somebody has asked that uh, if I stream on Twitch. Yes, I, I do. Oh, I'm supposed to. Well, I've I've made it a thing that I'm gonna try to do it on Wednesdays. Uh, and I don't know exactly what time I should put or whatever. I used to do them at like I th at first I thought oh I could do it at midnight, but then I'd be too tired most of the time. Then I'd do it at 10 a.m. Uh, t 10 p.m. I mean, but now um, I'm thinking like 8 a.m. Uh, 8 p.m. is like a good time for me to start because it's like it's after most of my work for the day is done, but also it's not too early for American people that they would be still at work really. Mm. Well, maybe they would. I don't know if I know. This one was just early because I just wanted to play Garfield a lot. Yeah. Can I push this with the ball on it? Oh, almost. Oh, fuck off! Stupid camera. You can't be mad at the mouse too long now. I can be mad at the camera. The mouse did nothing wrong. See, you just picked it up right then. It's like real quick, like, whoop, just slipped. Yeah. But yes, uh, if anyone is interested in me uh, trying to stream, um, uh, I will announce that on my Twitter, whatever I'm doing. Uh, I, what is my Twitter? <laughs> uh, fucking HGB guy Twitter? What's the usual default? It just should be HGB. Do you have underscores in it? That uh, is important to know. I don't think I do. No, I think it's just at HGB guy. Yeah. Right. Careful, little mousey. There should be a picture of cunt Corona, so you'll you'll know. <laughs> um. 
You want to go right, I think. I do, but there's also... I'll be moving boxes for ages if I do go that, so I'm just going to do this. Turning. Gotta jump off the ball. If it's 8 p.m., other Europeans could actually watch the stream, like right now. Yeah. I don't know when I started. I think it was like 6:58, 7. Yeah, I'm, I'll, I guess I'll try 8 p.m. Wednesday. Uh, that'll the I don't know what I'll do. I think I want to play Killing Floor more just because I'm a good at it. I don't know. I think I have Killing Floor. Yeah. I've got like a level 6 medic which took me like ages to get to that level but it's so fucking fun now that I just have that forever and I just ha have the power to be like really fucking helpful and I get extra movement speed and an automatic gun uh, as I spawn and it's, it's, it's really Oh, fucking so like cool. it's a FPS but you can level up and you permanently get, get stuff? Uh, you get a perk and you level up that perk uh, you know, like the medic, um, he'll have like better healing for his friends and himself. Healing rate, healing uh, item recharge rate, uh, cheaper uh, expenses for healing weapons and stuff. At, at, at level six, uh, the idea he is he moves faster so he can get to people to like save them with the oh. medic thing, no. the little syringe. Uh, and yeah, and where there's like there's like a guy who does shotguns and welding. There's like a explosion guy. There's like a melee guy who walks super fast, and he you know he has extra you know health because he's got to like go up right up to them and stuff. And it's really cool. Uh, but some of them like take ages because like for the welding one, you've got to do like so much welding, um, you know, to like get get a level up, you know, there's the killing with the shotgun, which is fine, that's, you know, good fun, but you don't always need to weld doors, it's kind of situational, um, when you have to, so, having to weld that much, you know, it, it makes getting the, you know, support, but you get, like, extra weapon space and extra ammo, and all that cool shit. Yeah, I, I'm just saying, because... I like the idea of an FPS where uh, playing it for a long time doesn't just, uh, like, you're not always, yeah. you you have, like, perks that, it's there's, like, a, there's a progression like a to it. It's a class system, really, Yeah. it's called perks, but you can just sort of switch between... Because I just like it when, you know, in TF2... You, you play long enough, you can unlock guns, and they can change your playstyle. You wouldn't like it; wouldn't be like a straight up yeah. perk. And you don't necessarily need to use the weapons in your perk or anything. You can like, use any weapon, but it's like, you know, you use these weapons better. Sometimes it's good to have like a pipe bomb, even though you're a medic. You know, to get like the big bad guy at the end, the little boss guy, uh, who's like a spooky man. Woo! It's, it's funny, I remember the first time I played Killing Floor uh, was uh, at Christmas and there was the robot Santa uh, as the the last boss and shit and it was, oh, what a, what a good time that was, with like all the Christmas themed uh, zombies and shit. Yeah, I remember you playing it in Christmas. Yeah. And there were like elf fucking weird guys and, oh, yeah. Fucking love that game. <laughs> oh shit! There's a dog. All right, let's see if we can murder this dog. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can murder the dog. <laughs> All right. This is every video game. 
<laughs> because I can murder a dog. Because you can do the Mario jump. Oh. It is Mario Odyssey. This is Mario Odyssey. <laughs> right here. Nintendo just ripped it off. Yeah, dude. What the fuck? I'm just trying to get that, that sweet Prince of Persia... Money. <laughs> Yeah. Because this is the Prince of Persia, you know, sequel. Yeah. The two thrones, the gay thrones, the guy, gay guys. Yeah. Right, that That's a wall oh, jumping thing, I've so I can leave that. Now you got me thinking about the co-op in the Lord of the Rings games on the PlayStation 2. Like the two towers and stuff. Yeah. With all the combos. I remember that was like, just, yeah. There were some, like, levels which were pretty, like, impossible, though. I think it was, like, the wall one died so many times oh, on that. Oh, man, dude, we should fucking stream the fuck out of that. Yeah. That is a good co-op. Actually, I don't remember it being a good, like, specifically good as in, like, good for two players, but we did play it because it was two-player. Yeah. Like, I and think maybe, it can be annoying because, like... not a kid, maybe I'll do, like, better. Yeah. And maybe I'll actually learn some combos and do them. Man, I fucking hate things with combos. That's the worst game thing ever, because it's it's just... It's... It's like... Use, using your brain to think in a way that wouldn't normally be how you play the game. Yeah. Like, if the game naturally makes you know the combos by them being obvious and good to use then a combo is okay, but if it's like you have to look up a menu in order to do any of them, because they just don't make any sense otherwise. Yeah. Uh, what was it? I remember there was some analysis thing talking about how in fighting games there's usually the meta, which is just the, the thing that everyone uses the fucking Hadouken, because it's just, it's, you know, it's easier than actually learning anything or something, because it's a projectile with a short combo thing and you just spam it or something whereas it's these other complicated things that look cool but like it's a lot of effort for not as much you know shit so yeah but like you know I think the thing was that you bought different combos, so you could ignore some really. Yeah, I always ones. I always get the passive stuff first. Yeah. Where the fuck? Where the fuck am I going? There's only eight. There's only eight. That's why. Okay. Um. Hoo hoo hoo! Fucking flying. Yeah. There's uh, uh, one over there. Oh shit! You're right. God, just about. I don't know where to go. Uh, they can't be that far, can they? Do you see any? Ooh, maybe. But I can't tell because it's so f fucking tiny. In it's. The I really hate the camera that you can't. I can't like just look a little bit. It's either completely up or completely down. Yeah. Keep an eye out. So oh, there's one down there. Oh, fuck off! All right, I've lost, but I see this one. Wait, maybe I've not lost. Yeah, yeah, I think that one up there is the last one. So yeah. Fucking did it. <laughs> Garf's a hardcore dog killer. Oh, <gasps> oh yeah! Yeah, dude! 
Oh, now we're full Now you can do the pursuit mission in the garden. Now you can do the time mission in the sewers. You can do the mouse mission in the sewers. You can do the time in the rooftops. You can dodge with the rooftops. Dude, I learned <laughs> so many things. Now we're really digging into the Prince That's of why Persia. you're my brother. That's why you're my brother. I like how you want to hear something really fucking funny as just sort of proliferated into everything I say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I do want to become the best jumping cat of all. Even if jumping is not necessary. <laughs> oh, you know. Oh, about. yeah, just watch Odie. He can do it. What? Actually, that looked more like a real-life dog thing that would happen. Just jumping up against the wall and jumping off it. Are you out of your mind? Excuse me, Garfield, you know what you can already and have already done. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, are you out of your mind? Wall jumping? Is that where you draw the line, Garfield? Doesn't make any sense. It's just like... Are you, like, really Prince of Persia? Huh, how do I... <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> this is beautiful! Whee! I love it! This is the best thing I've ever seen! <laughs> it's so majestic! Dude, I know all the possible moves! Oh man. I am Omega Garfield. Holy shit, dog. <laughs> it is, this is the true sequel to Prince of Persia. It still says extermination. I really should change that. <laughs> <laughs> Every stream is an extermination. <laughs> extermination of my brain cells. All right, let's go to the garden first. Oh yeah. Nothing. Can you stop have us to now. review this gem, of course, of course. Oh man. The only thing is, the fuck do I do about it? Well, I'll, I'll play the game, and then I'll play it again and collect footage for it because I guess I would want to see the sound effects and I don't have because you know the, if I take the streams it'll have footage of me talking over it mm. um, which is not perfect I can work around it a lot of the time if I do that um, by just not talking about the sound effects but maybe maybe it's important so I'll, just, I'll play a bit of it uh, in my own time uh, speaking of reviews, I've got uh, Ape Escape 1, Part 2, written. Uh -huh. I need to record it. Uh, oh. I need to I need to record a, a, a review of... Or I need to write a, re a review of Prince of Persia, which is what Deadly Comics That's, He wanted. said, Misky, she combined it with the Prince of Persia review. Yeah, that's the thing. I guess I could. I guess I could, but... You'd be like, oh... Well, the, the a better game in part two of Prince of Persia. You know what? That would be a funny way to, because I actually don't really want to play the whole Prince of Persia and make a review of it. So yes, the only thing is I'm not sure whether Deadly Comics would appreciate that, but I'm sure he likes my content anyway. So as long as it's funny, as long as it's funny and it's about Prince of Persia a bit enough about yeah. it. I mean, what wasn't it like your philosophy? Like if you can't get into a game, then you're not, you know, uh, what is it, if you, if, like, uh, you naturally wouldn't be playing the game any longer than you would, then you don't review it further. Ah, sorry, I just really <laughs> screamed right then. Um, <laughs> you know what I mean, though? I don't remember saying that. I thought you did. When did maybe, I say it? I don't remember. Maybe it was a while back. Maybe things are different now. No, I'm sure that means it makes sense to me. Fuck. It's like... I mean, I think you still put, like, effort into games, like, quite a lot. You know, you don't just give up immediately. So oh, if yeah. a game does make you actually give up, then it's like, well, you know... Then at what point is it really much worth much? Yeah, I think I think I'm I'm not sure about whether I said that because of the fact that I played Rayman all the way through. 
Um, but maybe that the whole point of that was I'm, I was playing it because it, I really just want to know what happens. And um, it was a challenge, and that was part of the, the point of the video, was that it was a challenge. Ooh! Yeah. So yeah, I guess. I mean, I like the idea of, of playing a thing all the way through. Just so I can say, well, I know. But if I, it, yeah, I, I guess I would agree with that. If uh, I don't want to finish it, I'm not gonna. You know what it probably was that I said that about? Is, um, fucking GRPJ. And specifically yeah. uh, talking about like the extra content, like the extra bosses and the secret stuff, and getting all 100% like, no. Like, I, if I beat the final boss, yeah. then I can do the GR, GRPJ, you because at that point... for completionists. Go watch the completionists. Well, actually, don't watch the completionists. Yeah, because he sucks. Not because he sucks, but because he doesn't even do the completion aspect properly. Yeah. Because he's just a fucking idiot. I don't like him. I don't like his content, it yeah. ruins my brain, yeah, just to just, think about. Just to clarify, I was joking, I don't, I, who would even watch The Completionist? <laughs> I did a long time ago, and I'm ashamed. <laughs> then again, I did watch a lot of like shit before I knew what good stuff was. I mean, most uh, people do. I watched Dr. Wolf, because I didn't know that you could say fuck. <laughs> That's really it. <laughs> yeah. I just thought, yeah, he's talking about My Little Pony. Oh, Papa My Little Pony. It's good to, to love My Little Pony. Yeah. Where well, do I go? I feel like, you know when I mentioned that in Minecraft stream that I have a worm brain for when I'm just playing Minecraft? Anytime I think about MLP, I go back to my dinosaur brain. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a worm dinosaur? <laughs> no, I just have multiple <laughs> brains <laughs> inside my brain. Uh, that are that they're just different types of mode of brain. I I, I like switch them out like weapons. <laughs> <laughs> and my abilities. Uh, <laughs> oh no! <laughs> so majestic. But yeah, it, it's just like so I started I remember what I used to do all the time as a brobony. I would just like think about the universe and the uh, just situations with the characters and and just stupid stuff until I'm like, no, wait a minute, that doesn't make sense. That's not canon and gay shit like that. And I started doing that again because I don't know why. For, but it's just like it felt like this is a very strange part of my brain, which is heavily, you know, trained to do that thing, and I can very easily do it, but I've just sort of been being like, no, don't do that. It's pointless. I don't need to get lasagna anymore, so I can just ignore it, I think. It's not even counting it up. Yeah. Oh, baby. Here we go. It's Shit. like it's like you know uh, when people like to do crossovers, you know, it's just sort of like, ooh, but what would it be? And it's like sometimes it's good, but like y you could overdo it and do it bad, you know. Wait, well, I was trying to read the chat just then. Sorry. They're saying things. No, I, I'm not. No, I'm not I telling really you to know shut up. What I'm saying, so that I'm, guy. Shit. Fuck. He's going. I'm just, I'm just gonna... Nah, fuck it. Can't do it. No, not continue. Fuck! Oh my god, I gotta go all the way back there. Just because I slipped. Because it's just fine. It's just right here. What are the people saying? They're saying things and uh, I can't read it. Uh, haha, -ha, just sneakily pe putting that in his game pay play footage. I think he was talking about, like, saying that you should, uh, in the middle of, uh, reviewing, you should slip some... Prince of Persia, you just slip like Garfield doing this wall jump in between. Oh, uh, oh, that would be I the perfect way to do it. I was specifically thinking, actually, in the middle of a Prince of Persia wall jump, you like cut from one wall jump <laughs> from one to the other to Garfield doing it, and then 
it just goes straight back to yeah, that, that'll Yeah, ju that'll just be the secret stream meme, is that uh, sometimes I just use Garfield footage in the, in the review and I don't mention it. Yeah. Uh, weaponized brains, because I was talking about my weapon switching brain. And Gib talking to his past self, his high past self, yes. Does he mean that I he doesn't know who I am? Or is what is happening? I don't know. This is my brother, by the way, is if you do, don't know who's talking. But I don't think that's what he was talking about. Hmm. I don't know what he means by talking to my past self. Yeah. Hmm. This game is fucking cool. Does he fall faster because of the coffee? <laughs> Oh man. Oh uh, god. No! Jesus! Where is he? He's up. Oh my, what? You have to get from the. Alright, well, that's impossible. Restart mission. I'm not gonna continue. Alright, so I gotta stay up on the ledges and get over the gate, which is closed for no reason. Was faster than I thought. Oh shit. Oh, um. Alright, that's fine. What? <laughs> French of pressure, bro. <laughs> oh man. This is fucking amazing. I fucking love this game. Fuck, I need that. I need that so much. Oh man, this long jumping shit. What is. How fucking far are we going with this? He said to the swimming pool, so. Lasagna in the cemetery, anyway. Well, why wouldn't there be? Well, you know, you gotta the cemetery the, on the roof. There, there's, the there's, la there's, the, there's, somebody made hundreds of lasagna and put them all over the castle, the roof, the gardens. Why not in the swimming pool? I already collected them, but like, you know, why not in the cemetery? Where else would you put them? <clears throat> yeah. Garden is done. All right. Yeah. But you weren't first, the parrot <laughs> got there first. Yeah, it's kind of weird how it, like, just because he didn't fall out of the range, he, he just gets to say, I won, even though he got there first. Yeah, but, uh, uh, who cares? Yeah. Are you kidding me? Garfield always wins. Always. always. Uh, let's, let's see the castle. Alright, I can do that. I still don't know where this lasagna is. But now you have all the powers. I do. I do have that. Da 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 I'm gonna let this play and see if it just shows me. Yeah. Oh no it won't. It's just right here. Maybe a door has opened. <laughs> Wait, 
Is the dog I killed not alive anymore? I think he's just dead for Oh it. no. Every dog you kill never comes back. <laughs> His legs. He really is the prince. <laughs> I mean in this thing he's like he's supposed he's like the he is called the prince. Isn't he? Yeah, he is. Because he's like royalty? Yeah, because they think he's the royalty. Because it's the switcher room. <laughs> oh man. No challenge is too difficult for Garfield. I don't know if I can get all the way over there. Nope. Shit. <laughs> no! Why are these knights here, hands? I thought I told you to kill them. Remember when we uh, did the Chamber of Secrets PS1 version? Yeah. That was a real cool time. I remember the nostalgia for a game that I never played was the coolest thing I've ever experienced. You know 20 what I mean? seconds. Yeah. Yeah, because it just looks like the one we know. Yeah. I think I'm going to lose this. Oh, now I am. Yeah. Uh. Read the chat. I think some Garfield. people are saying more stuff. like Gar Hill, more like Moe Hill. Why can't my cat break dance? Sands. Sands. <laughs> yeah. Why can't? Why can't? Huh? Yeah. Sounds like you got a defective cat there. He can't break dance. What yeah. is he good for? Breaking bars. <laughs> break. Yeah. <laughs> My cat can't break bars. He's too good. Go back up onto the fireplace, then lol. <laughs> <laughs> Long jump. <laughs> and then just lol. <laughs> at the world. At its pathetic state. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. He's just too powerful. He overshoots every shot he takes. <laughs> <laughs> so that he never hits anything. <laughs> yeah. That's like almost an aqueous thing. Um, where's 11? Oh yeah, aqueous. Shut up, axe. <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay. Fuck, fuck! Alright. Ah, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is he doing? Going around breaking vases and then allowing that to unlock various things in the castle? Yeah. Like, it's not even like, oh, by the way, we found a key. It's just like, oh, you broke a bunch of vases in this level. By the way, you can go to this level and find the mouse yeah, now. Now you, now you can long jump. Now you can fucking long jump. <laughs> now you can fucking fly. Uh, Whee! <laughs> wait, does Garfield propel himself through the air by actually farting? Maybe. Got all that super insane dust coming out of his ass. Super Saiyan Cat. Just does, any, does anybody remember Super Saiyan Cat? It's like a thing, a thing I did in a draw stream a long time ago. Oh yeah! I fucking <laughs> remember that. I think it's like my DeviantArt profile image now. Yeah. It's just Super Saiyan Cat. Super Saiyan Cat. 
one of my favorite things I ever made. Yeah. It was Garfield the whole time. <laughs> ever since then, we've been playing Prince of Persia, and we didn't know. Two lasagnas. Meow. Where they could be. Well, I mean, Garfield is the warrior of cats, says our cave prep the guy that I'm not going to actually put the name to the what my mouth. I can't say words. Well, I mean, I can't... <laughs> I can't read it if I'm playing. Um, Hang on. Ra Radical FPR. Yes. The Warrior of Cats. Uh, he... Is he... Does he like... Uh, I guess he likes stuff. Well, maybe if you put <laughs> he put garlic loves stuff. in lasagna. I love stuff. I stuff love in my lasagna. <laughs> then he kills people. <laughs> then he kills people. Fucking. <laughs> uh, Alright, this, this is a place. Just another normal day. It's just another gay day in gay Luigi land. When is there gonna be a Waluigi land? If they make a Waluigi game ever, people are gonna go, Oh! But nothing's gonna happen, I don't think. I think it's yeah. just gonna be okay. But what 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 would it be? I remember Germa saying that the uh, Waluigi should just die. <laughs> Canonically <laughs> die. Yeah, I, I, I watched that video as well. Yeah, Germa is the best. Well, I mean, that's not why he's the best. But, but, yeah, but he His is. opinions on Wario has made him my favorite man. <laughs> yes. Uh, Waluigi, I mean. <laughs> Wario and Waluigi! Oh, well, I'm dead. Does someone live in this castle? Asked Mind W. Uh, yeah, that, Garfield. That's a good question. Oh, I mean... It, 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 I think it, it, it's it, just it, the toad. It hasn't made sense for a very long time. Uh, whoa! What? Did I lose my lives? I guess I did. That was the first time I lost all my health. I think. Yeah. Just booted you me just, out. Just get you kicked out of there. Uh, I gotta get the yeah. Yeah. The sewer, though. I can complete the sewer. I can complete the roof. Man, fuck the lasagna in there. I don't give a shit. I'll get. I'll come back to it. Yeah. I want to go to the sewers. The sewers. 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 A date from exes and sores. Yes, the royal family, uh, the queen, and uh, the. Yes, they're all dead. Yes, it's a very strange land that they live in. Yeah. Oh yeah. It is a map. It has been a map the whole time. <laughs> Wee! Oh. <laughs> I, I was planning for that. Um, okay. I guess it's this way? Five hour video by Matthew Matosis. Oh. What, about Garfield? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I'm suddenly Smexican. <laughs> Smexican. I thought it was Con Corona. Uh, or, or something. No, con but no, corona. just Mexican. Con, con Corona is Mexican. <laughs> oh no, it finally comes out. <laughs> He's a Mexican who funds ISIS so he can have more people buy his pee. Man. That's why uh, Corona. You know. No. Oh. Oh. Um. One thing though. Mm. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> uh, one thing is about this. It sucks. Well, it it sucks in one ways. Uh, that I'm about to say. Uh, lasagna is health, but it's also a collectible. So once you have the lasagna, you there's no health anywhere. Yeah, that is true. Kind of difficult to play the games. 
Only an animal smaller than you can open it. Alright. You did this boss thing, didn't you? Yeah, I did this. And I, I, I need to get to the little green bits <laughs> on the just, map. Even though, like, you don't keep the same amount of vertical, the that the the same like uh, kind of speed just doesn't stop until you get right to the bottom. It's really fucking funny. So to yeah. Me. like Mario 64 then, coins are help. Yeah, but in Mario 64 the coins respawn. Yeah, you can, you get a high score of coins, but in this you just have them now. You ate them. I ate all my health because I was trying to be a completion. Yeah. A completioner. That's not gonna work. That's not gonna work. Oh no, I nearly lost my life. Yeah. God, I just love killing floor, I'm just thinking about it all the time. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kicked out of the sewers because of the sewers suck. Now I'm playing hard mode. Yeah. It's really strange. You know, I, ne I hadn't con I hadn't had this problem, but that is the really terrible life losing pr death. Yeah that you get kicked out of the thing and have to reload it. Yeah. Oh. Uh, I'm still thinking about killing four. They have a shotgun that has like uh, flame rounds. And it's like it fucking explodes of fire. And ooh, it's so fucking cool. You know? And if you play TF2, you can have the pyro as a skin, and it's like, yeah. That's, sh that's cool as shit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was just, like, really scared. <laughs> what happens when you get squished with this on? Uh, it just goes away. Oh. And then you go, oh! This is where the mouse is. Oh wait, no, this is where the wall jump happens! Oh, the wall jump! The wall jump! The wall jump! Bitches are oh, not yeah. shit! The power. The power? The power within. The power My ass. Oh, is your ass. Deo. Mousy, mousy, goo goo, gee mousy. Oh, you're so tiny. <laughs> They're both adorable. <laughs> They're both adorable, yes. <laughs> uh. What is he talking about? I don't know. Uh, having it fall in your mouth is just great. Oh, we can look in the feed. What does the subtitle say? Oh, it, it doesn't say anything. He just said, I have something for you. Having it fall in your mouth is just great. It's like, oh, I wonder what the fuck. You just dropped it. You just dropped the ball. Little boy, you just dropped it. Sniff, you dropped the ball. <laughs> sniff, 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 sniff. Where's the ball gone? Oh, there it is. I got the ball. Okay, I'm going to bring it back now. I'm going to push it back where it's supposed to go. Oh, it fell again. Wait, what? Did I do it? Oh. 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 I don't get it. I think I've messed up a million times. What? Maybe it was supposed to be like that. Okay. Doesn't matter. Um. Let's put this here. No, I just want to go down there. No, the it, it must go down there, that's that's obvious. The wool jump. I can't wall jump as a mouse. It'll be very funny. <laughs> yeah. You can't post things like fag in here, question mark? Uh, oh, is that like fucking auto twitch gay? I turned auto gay off. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I did that as well, but I swear it still does it because it's fucking a piece of shit. I don't respect it. 
I don't respect pieces of shit. I'll s fucking create a new language where you can say fag only. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the only difference. Um, why is this like that? Why is this? What's happening? I want to put something on here, something on there, but I couldn't push it on. Or is it on a different level? Sniff, 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 <laughs> sniff, 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 I'm a mouse. Your message wasn't posted due to conflicts with the channel's moderation settings. Oh, yeah. It might have been like a fucking gay thing where like the settings went to default or something because something gay. <laughs> I see. You know, um, well, you mean like it, I haven't changed them in a while and then they went back to default? Yeah, because they're gay. Uh, I guess that. Like, I, I, I just specifically remember turning off the, the moderator. Yeah. So if they just turned itself back on, that's bullshit. Yeah, but that, I I remember looking very thoroughly. There's actually a, cu a couple of things you need to do in order to like have uh, no words at all thing, the senses or something. I can't remember what it is, but I remember there's like a, a lot of different tick boxes in order to say, are you sure you definitely want to allow these things? Are you sure you want to opt out of the fucking thing of the beginning that's gay? Uh, <laughs> You know, so it's it's all automatically set to be like, don't swear, don't swear. Please. I swear I won't. Right, where in the fuck do I go? Do I go in here? Is this where I came from? I think this is where I came from. I don't remember that being where I came from, but it's just it's just <laughs> dark in there. English, but <laughs> with a fag. A dictionary by Gibbon Bro. <laughs> English, but yeah. Gibbon Bro sounds like a cool show name. If only there was a show there to happen. Gibbon Bros. Like Gib and Bros and also Gibbon Bros. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I tried to have Let's Plays before and neither of you... I mean, you did sometimes, but it was mostly just me. Yeah. Oh, okay. I get it. Don't cuss, my mom's watching. Ha ha. Bad bitch. I'm sure his mom was watching. <laughs> well, I'm a juggalo. What are you gonna do about it? Ha ha. He he. I'm gonna heat death the universe. God. You're right. There. <laughs> hey, it's me, God. I'm right here. He's right there. Uh, wait a minute. No, no, I'm doing it right. Look at that rat ass. Uh, Look at this. This is a screensaver and a half. Yeah. Gif that shit. Son. Man, I want to get back into singing ICP lyrics again. <laughs> we all do, son. We all do. I feel like I've been lacking. I feel P like I've been lacking in my ICP lyric singing. I just, why is it so completely black? Yeah. I actually don't mind it, but it's uh. Old video game thingy. Yeah. I don't mind it, but it's like, it does look silly. Yeah. How the fuck do I do this? Wait, he can do that? Wait, can you wall jump? Can you wall jump? Um. Can you wall jump? No. Oh, that would have been so fucking uh, this is funny. Very strange to know that I can. What? Oh, okay. So now I can use the boxes by just deleting them. I didn't even know that that was like a failsafe mechanic. 
What? Now these boxes are back. The power. The power of this mouse is unbelievable. The power. The sheer force to just sh uh, sit down hard on a box and destroy it. Um, how do I oh, bring this? Hyper Grapes uh, with a 4 for a day just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Oh, nice. Thanks, bro. Whoa, that was a loud splosh. It was a loud sploosh. Uh, you now have access to an emote. My only one, I think. Yeah. I think if you subscribe, you just have access to it. Yeah. That and also on your Discord. Yes. But yeah. mainly, you know, Twinge. Why can't I? I mean, I see that this is like elevated just a little bit, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do about that. Can you like slab the bolts? I'm trying. But they, they don't do that. They, they don't do anything. Do 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 do. Bitch, 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 bitch. Uh, hmm, 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 hmm. Can I look at the uh, the ramp? What it, does the ramp like? Get it onto the rail so it could go up. Oh, well, the ramp goes down. This goes over here. I mean the other one. And then this goes. Where the hell does this go? What? It's another one. But I didn't even do the first one. Wait, what? I'm baffled. All right, let's just figure this out. There's the. If I bring the thing here, because I can bring it here. Um, good fucking lord. Okay, so, there's that. Oh, you know what, those yellow fucking things, those yellow arrows are not for that. They're not for putting the ball in, the ball is going in over there. I made a mistake in my brain. I need to get up to the yellow thing, but the, the ball doesn't. So, if I just do some parkour... Parkour 94! Parkour dude... 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 Right, there we go! That's what it was! Yeah, but why is your Demon Souls video so great? Uh, Probably because I talked about Demon Souls in a way that not really many or anybody has before. And I was like, yeah. Yeah. I compare. I I talked about it in in a cool way, in a, in a way that was useful. Yeah, Dark Demon Blood Month was great. Well, it was mostly the Demon Souls. The other ones were like, yeah, we get it, we get it for that for that one. Yeah. Um, it was funny. I yeah, just uh, really enjoyed yeah. doing the Bloodborne thing. Oh yeah, the Bloodborne was legendary. I really, I really gotta just get on top of things again. Uh, once I have this animation done, I will be able to do like themed months way easier. Cause for August I've been really busy and also on holiday, and for September I'm probably gonna be animating. But you know, after that, no, no, fucking idiot mouse. At least that's still still there. Yeah. Right, let's go back up the shit. That's not that. You got no. You got to put a block in the ground. No! 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 I wasn't looking. <laughs> this is hell. I have to delete one of those boxes and then go through the whole process a million times. Oh, like, how shit. do I get over here? Yeah, I gotta put this one in the hole and then destroy the other one because there's only three of them. God, if only I hadn't fucking dropped it, I would be in the next part of the fucking level. Wait, do you even need to delete if you have. Oh, yeah, you do. Fuck. At least this time, I don't need to delete anything again. 
Uh, Dex, do you already have any ideas for themed months? Uh, I had one idea, which was point-and-click month, because I love point-and-click games, but they're... I haven't even tried to review one, so I don't know how easy that's going to be. Yeah. Um, I mean, I guess you yeah. go over the ones that you have played. No, I mean, I don't know how to review... I haven't reviewed any of them. Oh, okay. I haven't reviewed a point-and-click game yet, so I don't know how difficult it is to review. Should I play the entire thing and then rate the puzzles? I don't, I don't know. How does that, how's that work? I mean, what is the appeal of a point-and-click? That could be a video. I don't know. I like it. Sam and Max are my favorite pointy clickers. I have, like, a bunch of them on Steam, but they keep fucking up. It was like this shitty Steam sale where it's like, hey, get the whole Sam and Max pack. But then, like, everybody has, like, a broken version of Sam and Max on Steam, and it's like, everybody's talking about, like, what the fuck? Why? <laughs> Why is it so gay? Ah, uh, and you have to do this stupid, like, file thing, and it only half, and it only fixes it a little bit. It doesn't fully fix it. It only half fixes it, so that it sort of works, but it still, like, crashes for every other fucking piece of shit, so I can't enjoy it. But it is a great game. It's just that Steam fucked it up for me. Like Bosco's inconvenience store is the greatest idea ever. You know. I remember playing one of them. It was like 3D. Yeah, that's the one that I've got. Yeah, it. it I, I remember it being pretty funny. I but the thing about point and clicks is that there's a certain charm to them, but there's also a lot of patience required. Yeah. In order to to have fun with them. Um. I guess I don't mind that. I'm really just... Uh, I feel like it's like you need a certain amount of atmosphere to give you the patience to figure out the puzzles. Yeah. Like, if, if the atmosphere is too high octane, then you're going to be like, oh, god damn it, this, this music's too loud, and yeah. I'm trying to do all this stuff, and I'm going backwards and forwards. If it's like a nice, chill atmosphere, like Escape from Monkey Island or Broken Sword 1, or any of the Broken Swords, I've, I've only played the first one really. But like, the atmosphere is so chill and it keeps you calm so that you don't get too frustrated when you're trying to, to com get through these confusing puzzles. Yeah. But they are confusing, so I don't yeah, know. I remember like playing one of the first, like, uh, the Curse of Monkey Island games, or whatever, the first Monkey Island, uh, and like there's this, this, this item on a table so not clear. It's just a pixel, and like, there, there's like no way to tell. But eventually, you figure it out by like clicking on everything. But it's like sometimes in the older ones, uh, the clarity of like what are things you can touch, or what are even things at all, you know, is a little blurred. The only thing that I have a problem with in, in point and clicks is that uh, the c solutions don't make too much sense sometimes. Yeah. Like you just have a bunch of things and you just put them, you combine them with everything because it doesn't make any sense what you're supposed to do um, until you figure it out. But there are a few of them that are like, like actually, you know, you can figure it out. I like I, it I like I like it when. Um, you don't have too many different places to go so that you it's not like yeah. oh you need to go to this specific place and pick up this specific thing so that you can do this thing in this other place oh I fucked that up yeah and it's like I like it when the clarity of like when someone gives you a hint it's like subtle enough that once something else comes up it'll become obvious but uh, other than that it's like, you know, when when it's just like the clues are set up well enough, so like you know, it could sort of tell you, yeah, you know, that's the thing, but it won't like just tell you what to do, and then just be like, oh, whatever. I do, I do like the aspect of figuring it out, 
It's just sometimes it's like, what the f how was I supposed to know that? And in, in games where that uh, happens, the point and click games is like the, it happens so much more than anything else. Any other yeah. type of game, I think. If there's just anything esoteric, and, um, or, or like a part of the, the background that you does, it doesn't even look like you can click on to get something from it. Fucking god damn it. Yeah. Alright, that doesn't work. I don't really have the brain power to analyze why point and click games are good and or bad. I just I just know that I like a few of them and I'm gonna yeah. talk about them in a month. It's some month under indeterminate, I don't know when. I'm probably I'm I'm expecting September to be like a get it back on track month, um, after this whole animation thing. Because, you know, animation yeah. takes up a lot of time and resources. But I also got to work on stuff so that makes the animation take longer. Because I can't focus on it completely. I thought I'd miss those, but I didn't miss them. It's weird. I guess if you, like, pass one by, then it, the bombs behind just disappear. So you don't get incentivized to walk back. I guess. Oh my god, I fucking done the same thing again. Yeah, I'm, g I'm gonna go with that in mind. Like, I missed all of those, but I got them, I guess. Let me, let me test this out. It's like, oh, I, I missed them. Oh, no, no, it's not. You have to just keep going until you get 150 which may be a long time. So you can miss them. There's not exactly 150 to collect. No, I think it goes in a circle, doesn't it? Yeah, but the ones behind you disappear. Yeah. So it's constantly making enough until you get 150. I did exactly the same thing. It worked this time, though. Okay, um... Fucking difficult. No! God, my God, my God! I hate this. I hate this. This is terrible. Like, if I do a big jump, I'm gonna overshoot it because they're so close together, but they're not quite close enough for a double jump. Yeah. Except sometimes they are. I think the thing is to just stay on track and go around and miss a few. Yeah, but like, you only have like a minute. These things stop the time. But. Ooh. It's the last thing in the sewers, and it's the worst. Oh, I didn't do the double, didn't do the boost. What is it with that fucking pipe? Man. Like, look at that. If I do the boost jump, it really doesn't work with the arcs that they have the things on. But if I do that, then... Yeah. Like, I was, like, wasting time being in the air. What Are you? The fuck? I hate this. This is awful. This is like actually bad. Yeah. Why is that platform there? And why would they make you go that way if that is completely just in the fucking way? That's it's because this. I don't like these sewer le this sewer level. You fall down, you're fucked, because everything's vertical, and everything's terrible. <laughs> Can you think of a good sewer level? Like a sewer level that you prefer to the normal types of levels in that game? That's a good point. Because they're always worse. They're never good. The aesthetic is grimy and horrible. Oh, well, which is the point, but it's like... I kind of like uh, the one in 
uh, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets with the little kitten. Um, yeah. That's, That's the dungeons. I guess it's the sewers. Oh, I don't know. I guess it's the same sort of thing. Fuck. Go I'm gonna on. lose because of this frog. I'm not even fucking... Well, I am kind of halfway. Alright. Like, like, what do I do here? I couldn't not overshoot that. I couldn't undershoot. I couldn't do it. I just could not do it. I couldn't land on it with a double jump like this. This is unbelievable. Yeah. Like everything else in this game is fine. This is just like, 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 like all the there. all the other difficult things in this game feel like you can you can get better at them. I feel like this is like almost designed to be fucking annoying. Yeah. It's not even the last level. Maybe it's the last one of these types of challenges, so it's the hardest one. But, like, I don't know. I hate it. Yeah. Like, you're, it looks like you're supposed to double jump, but so often I keep slipping off because it doesn't... Yeah, it's doesn't... like one of those things you got to wait for, like, a couple of seconds before you do the next double part of the jump. Otherwise it fucks you up. Yeah, but there's such a fucking tease that it makes it pretty much impossible to follow it accurately. So you just gotta sort of almost, but not really, follow it. Right, well I've got not many to go. Just gotta not fall. Oh, okay. I should have looked before doing that. I need that clap. Oh, Even though I didn't do it. <laughs> Apparently Crash 2 has good sewer. Crash 2 has good sewers? Uh, I vaguely remember sewers and Crash. Mm. No, wait, fuck those sewers. With the, the electric and the water going up and down a bit. Which one is this? This is Crash 2, you haven't played it. I don't think. Uh, yeah. I think I only remember Wrath of Cortex. Or maybe it was the first boring. game? Maybe I'm thinking of the first game. I don't know the sewers in Crash 2, but like, I don't remember liking any of Crash sewers at all. What do they look like? I forget. I mean, they're not like worse than the rest of the game by much. It's just like, it's a difficult crash level, and you're going toward, you're going away from the camera, towards the background. Uh -huh. Um, and there's, there's lots of hazards on the floor because it's a sewers. Yeah. I mean, like, just by the concept, it's like, here's a shitty place, it has shitty things. You see that when his tail, you pause it, his tail goes up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right, back to hall. Maybe I'll be the first guy to make a good sewer level. <laughs> It's your big thing you want to make. Yeah. Well, the reason they have sewer levels at all is because, you know, oh, well, we, we need a, a dangerous area for our character to go to. Uh, uh, what make a, a whole fucking... game about being a boy in the sewers and make it the coolest, most aesthetic thing ever. I'll make this, the green the coolest green. I'll make the black the coolest black. I'll make it the coolest shit you've ever seen. Gay. Ha ha. You're right about that. Top 10 sewers? No! Never. Top 10 sigh. <sighs> sigh. Gangnam penis. Lol. XD. Very. Funny. X D D D D D. Bring. Bring me money. Put money I'm in my pocket. I'm it. I'm pressing the issue. 
The sewers in Oblivion are kind of cool. I was thinking about them, and I'm like, oh, maybe, but I, I was like, you know what? I liked finding uh, bandits in the sewers. It was pretty cool. I guess. Yeah. I put, I just kind of like Oblivion in general, though. Yeah. It's a good one. Yeah. God. Some people look at Oblivion and they think it's like shit. And I can see like flaws in it, but it's not shit. It's a good game. I don't think people think it's shit, but they say that they, it's. They just, they just look at the character models and be like, <laughs> wow, what a fucking. Who says that though? It's, uh, well. Like everybody, I, I know that. Like everyone does this, but they. I don't know whether you've actually ever well, seen somebody it, say that. There was a comment that I saw on. I can't remember who it was. Someone was doing a Let's Play, and they'd never played Oblivion. They were just doing it, like, this year or something. Uh, it might have been Germa or Dunkey or someone. But, like, they didn't enjoy the game for whatever reason, because, you know... But I just don't think it's their type of game in general. Uh, so, the fact that... I mean, the if, there's, if there's anything weird, to think about, like... Oh, bad graphics don't a bad game make. It's, if if cuz like, like you just look at this. It's like the guy doing the let's play was wasn't saying oh this is a bad game. He was just having a bad time with it. But because you know, people just sort of in first it's like oh this guy is having a bad time with the game. Uh, oh therefore God. it's a shitty game that no one should ever play. I mean, look at the character models, you know. Look at how fucking shit it looks. And yes, some of the faces look like dog shit in, by today's standards, but, I, you know, some of the what quests... What the fuck was that? I haven't even seen that enemy, sorry. I'm just really upset that there was a Zubat. Yeah, I was confused as well. But, you know, it's just like one of those, like, when some... You know, like, when you say something, and someone infers something completely wrong from it? Like, oh, he didn't enjoy this bit of the game, therefore it's a bad game. I'm gonna tell all my friends that the, my favorite YouTuber didn't like this game, but it's not, that's not what he said. That's not what he said. Uh... <laughs> No. Yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, uh, it's just one comment, though. I don't know whether I, I don't know. I had a, a a good amount of. Upvotes. I just because like the the only things I've ever heard people say about Oblivion is that they remember it. Like, ah, oh, Ran, remember that? <laughs> God, no! I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose. Oh, this is very slightly. I'm getting higher up. No, it's not gonna work. I fucked. I'm fuck. I fucked myself. Fuck. Man, these time things. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. Yeah, that skady, uh, skaged is a uh, right. You know. I'm not. I can't read uh, it. He says the Oblivion faces aren't that bad, but they're still right at the entrance to the Uncanny Valley. And it's still a good game, though. Yeah. I don't know. It, it, I'm not talking about that at all. It, it's just like I'm talking about the perception of Oblivion. Uh, people seem to like it. They just like Morrowind more, which I guess is fine. Uh, the only thing that I think people are wrong about is that Skyrim is better, which is, is not, is much worse. Oh, yeah. It is God. so much worse. Because it's just so boring. Yeah. I played I played the whole of Skyrim, by which I, by which I mean I didn't do any of the quests, because they were annoying and I don't care. I didn't, I didn't get any of the Dragonborn stuff, uh, even though I, was, I, I went around the entire world and collected all of the things. But I didn't have the the ability to use them, um, and I just as soon as I started like actually trying to beat the story after I did I explored the entire world, um, it was so boring. I mean, Oblivion is not much better, and really the the the, the story quest is like.
but it's just in, in general. Like, Skyrim quests, I could not give a single fuck about any of them. But I remember a few memorable Oblivion ones, like the Thieves Guild, yeah. uh, and, the, and the, the Assassin's Brotherhood or whatever. Uh, I don't know. I just, I just... The feeling I get from Skyrim is one of, like, complete nothingness. Yeah. And Oblivion All the is bandits just... bandits are interchangeable. You know, there's, there's, like, nothing unique about them. Maybe I'm wrong. I just... I, I, I don't know. Cause I've, like, I've played enough of Skyrim to know what it's like to play. In Oblivion, they have sometimes, like, set up uh, audio dialogue for certain caves with certain bandits that, you know, they don't really come back. Oh, no. But no. they've, like, got no. little bits no. of story no. writing. No. No. Fuck you. Sorry. This fucking... These time things are bullshit. Yeah. Like, this wall jumping thing takes so many seconds off just because of the fact that it doesn't work sometimes, and then... You just have to press... You just have to spam X to make sure that he actually jumps, because sometimes he doesn't. Yeah. Okay, and the bat, for some reason, was not in the way that time. Yeah. Sorry, I'm... I don't know. Uh, if the chat's talking about Oblivion or Skyrim, tell me. Uh, yeah. Uh... Thieves Guild in Oblivion was the Swedish ship with the scroll and the Grey Fox and junk. Oh yeah. Oh man, sneaking into like the Grand Archives to steal the fucking scroll. That was the coolest shit. And then I think you get the skeleton key from what was it like the they send you on a mission to do a day's request to get the skeleton key, I think. I'm not sure if that's true, but it's it's like oh I get the grey fox mask at the end of it and the key cool shit. It's just like cool cool really interesting items you get from quests that are memorable instead of like got Warhammer plus something frost interchangeable automatically generated something or other in a chest or some gold. Uh who fucking cares? The Grey Fox Mask is a cool, unique piece of something that, even if it's not in useful to me anymore, I can put it on a mantelpiece and think, this is fucking cool, and I can remember my cool adventure that I did to get this mask. Uh, whereas I don't think Skyrim has anything like that. Well, yeah. they have masks, but there are a bunch of them. And they all look the same, they just have slightly different colors. Yeah, the, the they're not unique, they're just sort of a collectible, almost. I cannot get into Skyrim and because people say it's the best Elder Scrolls I've ever played. Not. It's not the best. <laughs> uh, Morrowind, the Morrowind is the, the cult favourite. I don't know whether it's the fan favourite. Yeah. Um, but because of the amount of fans that got into it through Skyrim. But Morrowind is uh, engrossing. Oblivion is also engrossing, but if if a bit silly. Yeah. Um, and Skyrim is the Shit. blandest normie bullshit I've the ever fucking played. fucking opening takes so long. That fucking cart. How can anyone just, like, go through that cart thing every time they want to make a character? Which is something I want to do all the time. It's like, you know, I don't want to always just finish the game with every character before I make a new one. Sometimes I just want to, like, oh, but what if I start off as an archer now and do that shit? Uh, I gotta wait on a cart for a dragon and then do the same shit like Urgos so of the Imperials and I got I have to be the Dragonborn. I can't just be an adventurer doing whatever the fuck. There is a mod that fixes that, but why the fuck should I need to fucking fiddle around with fucking mods and shit for it's the game to be good? You know? The one thing I've always felt about Skyrim is that the location is just too bland looking. Yeah. Um, like it's grey and it's snowy, and they they do an okay job of making it like the most variety of a snowy tundra that they can. Yeah. Um, but it's still like it's still Oblivion boring. is just so much nicer to be in. I mean, M Morrowind 
had giant mushrooms for trees. It was like a mossy swamp fantasy land. And Skyrim, why can't it be like bizarre and just out there, but they yeah, went for it, realism? It really was just a snowy place. That's it. Yeah. There's orcs occasionally. What is he doing? Oh, he's dancing. I mean, I'm... I don't know how much in Oblivion, but I feel like there are some sort of fantastical, whimsical places. And they have the Shia Gorath DLC that takes you to sort of a Morrowind-like place with all the bizarre shit. And there's like there's that level in the painting. You remember the painting oh, yeah. level where you go into that's just a painting. That, you just talk to a guy about a quest, starting a quest, and then you suddenly see, you're in a completely different place. It's a very cool and memorable quest that you go into a painting. You go into a painting. Well, what, what was the one where you go into like there's like inside a guy? Uh, maybe it's the painting one as well. But like inside people's memories. Uh, oh yeah. Oh, oh, there's like, there's actually multiple things involving going into people's memories. Like, there's some Daedra quests where you go into sort of like the mind. There's a Mages Guild quest where you have to help a guy who's sort of gone into a coma because they fucked up some magical shit. And you need to help them deal with their paranoia and other parts of their brain and stuff. And like ones like the arena from you know the gladiator bit in the central. Oh, it's so it's so fucking. It's it's cool. got so much more going for it. Like Cyrodiil, it's just a richer environment. It's yeah. it's it's like it's like if you tie if you try to get like a one area of Cyrodiil and turned it into an entire game. I don't know. I yeah. think I think I think they fucked up by continuing to be a Skyrim company. They are never going to make the next one. Oh my god! All they're doing is doing. Uh, they are never going to make online. And now, oh, you know what their next announcement is? Is like Morrowind online, you know? Because <laughs> that's definitely going to. Because they don't. They they, they capture the same charm. They that don't Morrowind want has. to make. A new thing. They're stuck with Skyrim. I don't know why, really, because they they're, made they're, Oblivion. No, they're stuck with Elder Scrolls Online and microtransactions. Uh, and I mean, that's. I mean, that's whatever. The, everybody does that. But like even before then, all they were doing was working on Skyrim and then making a Skyrim HD remake and then Sky and then Skyrim for this and a Skyrim for that and hey guys, it's new Skyrim stuff and uh, oh let's do Fallout now. We'll do Fallout and Elder Scrolls. Oh um. Uh, we haven't made an Elder Scrolls thing in a while, let's just re-release Skyrim. Like, all they do now is Skyrim. And it's really upsetting because... Why wouldn't they? Why wouldn't they try to make the next place? There's so many other places God. in in the in the in the world that they could yeah. create continents for. There's they haven't fucking done it yet. That I haven't. That's apparently part of the Elder Scrolls universe. But it's not like one of the normal ones, it's more like a storyline based one where you're like a guy in a rebellion in like Hammerfell where like the the black ones, you know, that race comes from the whatever you, the Red Guard. They're, <laughs> they're, just, they're just the race of the black people, they have... I would love race. a sandy but desert Red Guard like, thing. Like you have a Cutlass, there's this story about, it's like Morrowind aesthetic level graphics, so they made it at the same time as that, but like... Uh, oh, I want to play it, <laughs> but I don't know how to get it. Fuck, I've just heard about it. It would be cool. I don't even know if it would work, but it's just like, that's a cool place, Hammerfell. What about the deserts of the Khajiit, you know? Or, or, or like the fucking Elven Isles, you know? A, de a desert, I think a, after fucking Skyrim for 20 years or however long it's been, um, a desert level, a desert level, a desert map place would be good. I mean a vibrant desert, not like... Well, yeah, obviously, like, there's, there's lots of things you could do with a desert. There's lots of things you could do with a tundra. It's just... They, they didn't they, do it. They didn't do it. God. I was looking at, like, uh, Digi and May doing the warrior wear, and I looked at, like, the ice level, and I looked at that really cool blue ice, and I was thinking, God, why can't Skyrim just stop being real 
and <laughs> just be like <laughs> that. Be ice like that. Be real cool. Yeah, fucking it, it's ice. really just a, a big, big old, big old. Oh, realism is in at the time they made it, and then they stuck with it. And I, I, I really am wondering. I'm really wondering whether it's just because it was so more successful than Oblivion, but I can't imagine that it was. I think it just appealed to the dormies, and they're the bell curve and all that shit. Yeah, but like, why... Ah, uh, maybe it was because it was just realistic. I mean, I wouldn't mind them making a new realistic game, it's just... Fuck Skyrim. Yeah. You didn't do a good job, but you you just... You're like, you're like, uh, you know, any any creator on the internet that has made one thing uh, that has appealed to the massive amount of people and they got a bunch of money from it, but it's way worse than anything else they've ever done. And they don't seem like they care about what they used to do. Yeah. I don't know, I, I, I just... No, you're I keep right. thinking, thinking, thinking of the way I would... if if I had success of that kind. <laughs> oh, yeah, I can't really. Woo! <laughs> the timing. Timing. Like, if I had success, I th I'd like to think that I would have in, in at least a feeling of wanting to continue creating. But maybe at some point I'm just going to get tired of it. I don't know. I don't like to imagine that because it it just really makes me sad every time it happens to a company or a person where they just stop and f and for no reason. Yeah. For no discernible reason, they just don't care anymore, and it's bad and sad and uh, yeah. Yeah. I think the modding plays a big part too. Oh, they're talking about Skyrim success. Uh. There was just more gamers plus the previous Elder Scrolls fan. Yeah, it's it's just fucking. But like, you can mod Oblivion and Morrowind. I used to do that all the time. That was my childhood. Was like, I got a flying ship in Oblivion. It was in German because fuck, you couldn't do translate. But I got a flying ship in Oblivion, and it worked. Even though it like crashed sometimes, but it was the fucking coolest fucking thing you ever did see. God damn! It's just it's just because the modding for Skyrim is implemented, and people don't want to go to like the Nexus or anything to like do modding. I don't know. It takes effort. It takes extra clicks. It's I'm... not put in front of you. Maybe it was just that the modding was like easier access for people. But I feel like it's more that it was just more successful with a different audience than before. Like, Oblivion, you know, it's fun for the the people who like that sort of thing. Yeah. But Skyrim is like, hey, you want to be a sword guy? Wow! In a real pretend world? Like, that's the level at yeah. which they're, they're, they're marketing it towards little babies. <laughs> yeah. I mean, God, Morwin has a great aesthetic, and, like, uh, if only you didn't hit, like, zero until you have, like, a good enough level. But at the same time, in a weird, patrician way, I kind of fucking love that that is the case. No! You cunt! <laughs> oh, shit. Um, yeah. It's like... Well, you, you do choose your skills at the beginning, and some skills are just sort of worse. They're not fully balanced, but it's like, yeah, you're you you can you're more likely to hit with the things that you actually train with, and you hit usually zero, only on things that you haven't chosen as, like, major skills in Morrowind. So, like, yeah, of course, like, you can't fucking use a short sword, because you don't have any fucking training with it, you bitch. You, you're like, it's like, it's like a dice roll with a fumble in D and D or some shit, but it's just really abstract. Uh, you know? I guess I do. Yeah. And oh fucking, you in Morrowind? That's just like the Jesus I can walk through the fucking air magic 
that's that's the kind of cool cool magic that's just like weird shit that can happen like I remember one of the most fascinating things I heard, you know, heard about in Magic and RuneScape was like the telekinesis and seeing the gold in the bank and being like, I want to grab that gold and stuff out of that, you know, vault uh, in Varrock, I think. Uh, yeah, somewhere. And it's like, yeah, I, I just, ooh, I want to do that because it's, it's not just like an attack or something, it's a, a specific utility unique little magical power that lets you do something that's not just about uh, uh, being fighting. someone up yeah yeah it's about you know maneuver and cool shit just magic being cool shit you know yeah that's why Harry Potter games are good because it's really well the early ones at least it's all about using your magic to get through puzzles instead yeah. of shooting, but then it became a shooting game. God. I still haven't played any of those shooting games, but um, yeah, I assume they're bad. I assume at, l I assume at least they, they don't have the magic of the other ones. Telekinesis Thief was my favorite thing in Morrowind. God, that's not, it's just like, the fact that you can be a Telekinesis Thief in Morrowind, and you can't do that in fucking Skyrim, bro. Get fucked. Skyrim can go suck a Lincoln log. Oh! Okay. Well, no, it's not good. Not what I wanted. Oh yeah, just like all the fireballs and lightning bolts in Skyrim are the most exciting thing in the world, yeah. right, guys? Yeah, he's right. He's like, you know. They're completely interchangeable shit. I mean, it'd be different if, like, you shoot, shot lightning into the water and then everybody in the water, like, gets zapped for, like, a radius or some shit. Or, like... I mean, fire t sort of does, but it's like, oh, there's, there's oil conveniently placed on the floor and it doesn't have to be fire. Sometimes lightning works. Or whatever. Yeah. I, I I did talk about this in a video, but I just don't like the way Skyrim has the magic hand there. Yeah, the flimsy fucking hands. I, I I agreed very heavily with what you said in that video. I I just couldn't un just just fuck and fuck Skyrim. I, I, I could articulate it, but at the end of the day, it's just fuck Skyrim. Yeah, that's really the best way to put it. What do I do now? I don't do anything! I've done the roof, I've done the sewer. Castle. Alright, that's it. I just need to find two lasagna, and we can f beat the game. Fuck. Like, imagine if every time you choose a different uh, type of magic, the way, like, you imagine the camera changing, like, the whole gameplay style just changing because you're using a different type of magic. Imagine if that was the case. How fucking cool and interesting would that be? I'm sure that, I'm sure there's good indie games that have, like, magic interestingly implemented in yeah. their thing. It's just, I don't fucking know about them. I don't research things like this. I just know that Skyrim is not a good example of a thing. Yeah. That's why I'm always like, uh, Skyrim's your favorite. Mm. Oh, you like you like Legends of Zelda, the, I mean, like, the 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 one that sucks. Uh, like, I don't blame them, but I just like, come on, there's, there's better things. It's just, it's just, it's just bleh. I know things that have the same appeal as Skyrim that have it better. You know, I mean, I just probably can't think of them right now because <laughs> I'm not I'm not a list boy uh, <laughs> top <laughs> ten <laughs> things that are probably <laughs> as good as get, get all that you want out of Skyrim except it's better unless the thing you need it to be called Skyrim and that's it <laughs> then I can't do anything about it oh where are these lasagnas woo 
one hands a torch. There's a lasagna. A Fuck. There's the la there's a lasagna there. It's because I used the wall jump. I guess I've never been up here before. Whoa. Okay, maybe they're both up here. Fuck, dude. It's just right there. Okay. Um, <laughs> long jump, maybe. Well, maybe, like. Fuck is it. Is it possible if you? Got it. You got it. I was thinking though, if you missed it, you get on that table, jump off the box, then wall jump. Yeah, maybe. No. I, I love find. Donald Trump's PP. I am <laughs> Donald, Donald Trump. Trump. I am Donald, Donald Trump. Trump. Oh yeah, when are we gonna make that other music? Um, hopefully before Charlie goes. Yeah. Ah, oh, man, I'm busy. I'm busy all the time. You know what? I'll get him to play a bunch of crap, and then I'll sample the fuck out of it. Yeah. That that That's much more manageable than thinking of songs, is to have everybody just record little bits that I can just edit into whatever. Yeah. And then do gorilla style. I'm a home band singing. I'm a gay Luigi. I don't know how to sing. <laughs> In gorilla style. Yeah. Uh, what does he say? Who says you need to sing perfectly? Maybe you could add an echo to your voice and be all alien. Well, yeah, obviously. I could do shit with it. I'm just trying to think of the fucking lyrics of one of them. Um. Uh, the. I got sunshine. In a bag, I'm useless, but not for long, the future is coming on. I ain't happy, I'm feeling glad I got sunshine. In a bag, I'm useless, but not for long, my penis is coming on. It's really long. It's really long, it's, it's really, really long. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Alright, that place over there might be a place over there. But is this place over here a place over here? No. No. Gibbs Pro Skills. Minimum quality is so good. You like it? That's good. I want the I want the next one to f to feel like a Gorillaz album. Yeah. Just cuz I I've, I've been into it. You hit the nail on the head with the point about the hands and yeah. Yeah, dude. I hit that nail right up that head. <laughs> <laughs> you sure did. God that it's it, it, it even when I when I'm not expecting it. The, the wall jump is just like... <gasps> as much as it tries to kill you all the time. Okay, fucking... Let's see. Lasagna. Lasagna. Where are you? Is it possibly in the box? Oh my god, it is might it be in the box. In the box. Yeah, fucking got it! This happens every day. We now go to the catacombs. This is it. We're gonna beat Garfield too. God, I really hope there are let's plays. I mean, not, not uh, speed runs is what I meant to say <laughs> <laughs> of this, because they would be so cool to watch with all the long jump and wall jump shit. I mean, it is really funny that this is Prince of Persia and he's calling him His Highness. <laughs> like, it just, so, it just so happens to be exactly the same. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> that dog is gonna kill you. Oh no! I'll bet he's evil. He's a dog. Can't trust him. <gasps> Alcohol! 
Yeah. What's up with the camera here? It's like showing me the door at, at all times. Is this a bus? I think some shit's about to go down. Some shit's about to go boosh. Oh, look, he's standing on the table like a cat. Yeah, it's almost as if he's a cat. Well, oh, what's gonna... It's... It's a human being, finally! We found it! Prince of Persia. I don't know how he managed to come back, but the lawyers will be here any minute now to destroy uh, the Prince of Persia. Uh, <laughs> get fucked. I'm the Prince of Persia. He really wants to destroy the... This time you stops. won't get away with my great plan to hide in the cellar. Even if I'm the, not the Prince of Persia and I'm Garfield, uh, I'll kill you. <laughs> He's gonna <laughs> fuck his shit up. It's just like a, a small orange cat's like, Aha! Get back! I'll kill you, you cat! You're going down! And I'm like, it's a cat just came in the room. This, what? this ghetto capitalist really just wants to, like, ruin the market for everyone. Um... What am I... <laughs> like, really, what am I doing here? I'm not, I'm not damaging him. What are you gonna do? I think you gotta make him break these things. That's pretty easy. Oh my god, the shit! The shitty is coming alive! Hey. Oh, oh, okay, you got me there. Oh, I didn't quite get on the button. Okay, that's, that's two. Is it just gonna be four and that's it? I think that's it. That this this is how you defeat Lord English. <laughs> he is English, because he's you know royal. He hasn't even changed up. I, he's probably got phase two. Let's be honest. This isn't yeah. going to do it. <laughs> In phase two, he becomes green. Oh and wait, am I supposed hunky. to? Yeah, I'll destroy your plans for building things, and you'll never know how to plan again. <laughs> God, this is the ultimate revenge. Yeah, fuck your buildings. Like, what? Is, <laughs> what is this guy thinking? This cat came in here. He's just ground pounding. Cats can't ground pound. Cats can't double jump. He's not even going to like pick him up or like chase him. He's just yeah, like, it's, it's, like, it's just a cat. I uh, just a cat came into my cellar and started <laughs> butt pounding on all my buildings, and I'm trying to kill him with all this wine. <laughs> All this expensive wine that they're gonna oh, notice shit. is missing, and they're gonna complain about like, what did you do while you were in the cellar this whole time? Why did you? The, the, it doesn't matter that whatever schemes he's doing with like uh, fucking people over, the the real thing that he's gonna get like killed for is the fact that he's 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 selling he's getting rid of all this expensive age-old Buckingham Palace wine. Fuck! I'm dead! Ugh. I hope this is it, because, like, bounding on these things is not uh, easy. It's annoying. Yeah. I'm just going to go back in there. Like, <laughs> oh, the cat's back! I threw bottles at him until he ran away, but now he's back. Good thing I managed to rebuild all my shit. Oh man, apparently they saw Maltesers in the America. Well, now I can go there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know whether I like Maltesers that much. I've had them... Uh, um, I've had them a couple times, they're alright. I used to I used to like sucking on the chocolate until there was no chocolate left. I like them when they're, they're not melting, when they're very solid. And, uh, I don't know. I think when I was a kid, my teeth were a bit better, so I have sensitive teeth and stuff. I think once, like, I've got the pro enamel and my teeth can, like, take it, I like crunching into them, but before that, uh, teeth, sensitive teeth go, eww, when something's a bit hard, or, ick, you know. You know. Wait, maybe I can just go and do them, like, right now. Fuck. 
Fuck, I missed. Now the camera's fucked. Alright. <laughs> what did he say? What did he say? <laughs> uh, who's your daddy? Alright, now I hate this game. <laughs> I'm glad I wasn't listening this whole time. If he's yeah. been saying, like, shitty one-liners. Like how? Sometimes you just you can't get away from the fucking. I'm gonna die again. I can't get away sometimes. Dog. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> you can't get away. He says as he leaps <laughs> very fucking far away. Right. One more to go. Like wizard crackers. I wonder if he's just going to be real sad after I do this and die. <laughs> That's just how you kill him. <laughs> Imagine if he just. What did I do? That sheep has not been there the whole time. You would get away with this. Why is he talking to a cat? <laughs> <laughs> How many are There's there? a pig! So wait a minute. There's a pig now. So wait a minute. <laughs> the only reason he didn't like pick him up and kick his shit in is because the, another cat came in and he was scared about There's a peacock. being too many. I don't know, these characters were here. I think they were there at the very oh, beginning. Oh, maybe they were. But they just didn't reoccur. <laughs> what face is that? Uh, congratulations. <laughs> Nightmare difficulty! <laughs> Oh man! Wait, that's not the that's not this the is... term you'd associate with a little cat game. Oh yeah, nightmare difficulty on right Garfield there. 2, the, the movie. The hardcore game. speedrunners of Garfield oh, 2. Oh no. I gotta play it. I gotta play nightmare <laughs> you difficulty. You gotta do it. <laughs> Alright. Um Alright, save. <laughs> no god. I gotta try it, but I don't think it's it's gonna be Imagine if like everything's really fucking spooky and it literally just becomes Yeah, like like Prince a like nightmare fuel. It literally just becomes Prince of Persia. <laughs> That's what the nightmare fuel is. Alright. Options. Game Difficulty Nightmare. I can't believe <laughs> I can't believe Garfield has a nightmare setting. All right, save changes. Back, back to game. Uh, so I guess I just go. Let's go to the garden. <laughs> so it was not normal before. I could have made it easier, but I didn't. So I guess I go to the places I've already been and. Uh, do the missions again. I guess that's what it is. Yeah. Right, that's a dancing. I don't want to do nightmare. Vi Actually, I do. <laughs> I want to do nightmare dancing. <laughs> On nightmare difficulty. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see how many fucking arrows there are. This doesn't look too difficult. Well, this is the first level. Wait, what? How? How am I supposed to do two at the same time? Is it analog as well? Oh. Oh, you're supposed to do the different analog sticks with them. Alright, I get it. I've been using the D-pad. Because that's all I needed. 
I'm remembering like the monkey. Yeah, monkey uh, ape escape two. Yeah. Dance monkey dance. Yeah. God, I would want to play that now. That's such a cool and fun. Oh, the the drum. Yeah. I mean, it's not difficult. But it's, it's, it's more just like you watch the monkey... No, I, I'm talking arms. about this. The, oh, yeah. This is Nightmare. Oh, what a fucking nightmare. Look at... Look at it. So... So really, there is no terrible. extra content. Because, I mean... Why would I do these missions again at harder difficulties? They were alright, but I, I enjoyed jumping around like an idiot more. <laughs> Did you see that little last <laughs> frame? Oh, you've been the high score. All right. The uh, high score. Is there a world record for this? I got a hundred percent, dude. I I just have a hundred percent. Whoa. All right. I'll, I'll try one more thing on nightmare difficulty, but after that, I think the stream might be over. <laughs> uh, it's a good, good, fun playing Prince of Persia, everyone. Yeah. I just noticed that it's an elephant topiary. It's alright. Nightmare difficulty for one of these. But in the garden. <laughs> <laughs> the objective of this is... Did you say pie? Oh, nightmare difficulty means that there's just less time. So nothing is different. Oh, that would mean in that fucking sewer level, you would have to not miss any of them. Yeah, so... Fuck that. Fuck that, indeed. So wait, on easy, would it just give you more time? I guess. Hmm. I didn't even know there was difficulty settings. It's funny, though. It's like... It's, 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 it's a bizarre concept that there is an unlockable nightmare difficulty for Garfield. Yeah, but like in, in on like, missions that you've already completed in order to get the difficulty. I mean, like, I can imagine this game... In fact, it's kind of weird that this has a hard mode, because it's sort of like a, a kid game, really. And having, like... It should be like, oh, if, it, if normal isn't good easy enough, then try easy if you're a baby. But then yeah, I think they put Nightmare Difficulty in because Nightmare Difficulty is a thing that was around at the time, maybe. Like, maybe first-person shooters were having Nightmare Difficulty. Oh, man, I'm actually going to lose. Oh, no, I'm not. It's just kind of hard. <laughs> right, I don't give a shit about saving that. Yeah. Oh, Garfield, you're the strongest and the funniest. You're the smallest and the fattest. You're the squeakiest and the stupidest. You are better than Bubsy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, what a title. Yeah, what a game to complete. What a game indeed. I had no idea this was good, and I'm glad I actually gave it a chance. Yeah. Because, you know... You know, look at this. Some games they they want to be like real long, but Garfield's like one of those indie masterpieces where it just it, it, it just, it just <laughs> takes enough time. It's an indie masterpiece, and yet it is a huge um, uh, like license thing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Despite that fact, it is an indie masterpiece made in India. <laughs> right. I'll, I'll just African save it. Alright, everybody, thank you for watching Garfield. Yeah, look. Five hours, 100%. Yeah. Not difficult at all. I would recommend you buy a PlayStation 2 and Garfield to the video game. Speed run it. Get the world record. Yeah. Uh -huh. Good day, little boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right.